<laughs> Found that in the locker recently. Let me get it queued up. I hope you're all doing good and ready for a fun Monday night. Mama G, what's up? Thanks for being here. Always, always, always. Mama G is our moderator, everybody. Probably all of you already know that, but just in case you don't. Hunting Lost Treasures, what's up? Cajun Thrifter Gal, John Agnes, 209 Thrift Bandit. Oh, yeah, nice. Looking forward to all the Disney. We have a ton of Disney. This last locker, last one, meaning uh, the one that we showed in the last couple of videos, found a fair amount of good Disney stuff in, in the next. Well, we're not done with that one, but we do switch to a different locker because uh, we bought a couple small lockers. And my mom's here. What's up, mom? And uh, then we'll go back to that locker and find more Disney stuff. But the stuff we're selling tonight is stuff that you would have seen in the videos if you watch us on YouTube. Found a, um, Pretty good collection. Utif, what's up? JW Fines, RJ Huyens, uh, Rick, what's up? Thanks for being here. I probably messed up your last name. Uh, Pollock, this thing's flying now. All right, we got some people. Make sure you enter this giveaway right here. Uh, so there's a little floaty I found in the locker. It's just SpongeBob. If it wasn't SpongeBob, probably wouldn't even give it away. It's just fun. And summer's coming. Phoenix Rose, what's up? Yeah, we had um, I had some fun today. Went to an auction about an hour and fifteen minutes away from my house. Auctioneer posted last night that two of the units they were selling were from a deceased owner. So I went there thinking that that owner owned two units. Turns out two different units, two different owners. Uh, both of them passed away, unfortunately. But we do like those units because we figure that people haven't gone through them and pulled the stuff out. And then I wound up buying another unit, a very large unit that has been there for 25 years and uh that's what it looks like it looks like the train wreck it looks there i mean 25 years i don't think it's been gotten into for 10 years but look at all those bins those are mattresses on the left bins galore i don't see anything good in the bins i'm basically completely gambling on this one i spent 2700 i just i couldn't pass it 25 years rented 160 bucks a month. It's got to be somewhere around 30 or $40,000 in rent. Uh, of course, when they started, probably the rent was much less, but that's still a lot of rent. A very long time. Lots of dust. <laughs> Hunting Lost Treasure says, beautiful. It's beautiful. And then I bought two others. So I bought three today. I cleaned one out. And in, in, uh, I don't think the lady had been there for 20 years. So she... Uh, not disturbing a locker for even several years. And they're outdoor units. We're both wearing Mickey <laughs> Disney. Paula says, I, of Rut Row, I see books. I know. That, that almost was a deal breaker for me. Um, but we'll, we'll see. Maybe we'll have some luck. Maybe there'll be good books. I doubt it. Auction Expeditions, what's up? Scal the Benko. Thanks for being here. He's got a new name. Same same friend, new name. Same friend, new name. I love it. All right, did you start the auction? Two uh, giveaway, but two hundred nine thrift bandit. What's up? Want to pick a winner on this Patty one? Patty Snell. Do something new. Sure, Jenna. She just walked in. She's already bossing you around. I'm just asking. She's cracking the whip. She's keeping it running. Hey, CJ Carey. What's that? Your mom, Carey. I know. I said hi to her. A lot's happened. Yeah, since we started oh so long ago. Carrie, you got this. It's such a Rats. fun little fun Half little price gift books. There. I take them there too. Yeah. I wait. He doesn't have patience for I don't it. Have the patience. I'll load them up and take them though and take that hundred bucks. It's not always a hundred bucks, but the last time she went it was a hundred bucks. I waited there an hour and left with like seventeen dollars. And it's like that's not a good use of time. <laughs> they don't let you leave either. Uh, Janice sneaks out, but they don't let you leave. So I they do. they want you to stay. They tell you you need to stay in the store. So when we paid you, you 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 come right away. I go to Michael's. Yeah, whatever. I don't like it. Let me show you the other one. Well, I bought three, but here's the other one I got. This one I spent three fifty, and this was another uh, one of the ones where the owner passed away. And again, it, it looks really junky. But um, you see some deer antlers there. And uh, 
Yeah. I see a lot of dust. A lot of dust. So like, look at the dust on those boxes. Spider webs, dust. It, it, this also, all three of them don't look like they've been gotten into for 10 years, maybe longer. That's what they, they look. Of course, outside, in, oh yeah, there's a, look at that lock. The the handle, like, you see the dust there? That and that's, dust. see the piece of the lock is totally rusted. Mm -hmm. It's just been sitting stagnant for several years. Crazy, right? Look at this one kicking it old Spent 350 on that one. But when I left, and Jenna doesn't even know this, but um, when I left, I went, uh, the big one I rented for a month is a 10 by 20. The big, uh, so when I le left, the, the lady said, oh, the other one with the deceased owner that you didn't get to yet, that one, the guy used to work for a gun store. So <laughs> I was like, ooh, a gun store, do tell. She goes, yeah, I was right up the street and he worked there for years. So we already saw deer antlers. I said, maybe it's a hunter. Um, so that could get exciting. I'm really excited about it. What size of the shirts? They are mostly double XL. All different. But I think there might be an XL, there might be a triple X, but most of them are double XL. Yeah, a lot of big ones. Two X. Double X, yeah, it's good size. Nice, right? Okay, make sure you guys enter this if you want one of our locker nuts beanie caps. We're giving it away. The Fantasia Mickey one is super sick. I love it. This is my favorite one. That's why I put it on here. Yeah. I'll show it to them. We have hats, Disney hats. We have some lithographs. So has the tag on it. We have some picture frames. We have a lot of Disney stuff. Never been worn. Yeah, that's yeah. We have lots of great jewelry tonight. Any jewelry tonight? Yeah, we got oh, silver yeah, jewelry. Do. I could give you guys a little tour if you want. Just let a few more people come in. We got 105 people. We better get started here. Yeah. Let me show you real quick. I'll give you a little tour of the room. I'll show you what we got. I just want to share those lockers that I picked up because. Any old minute. Hi. Come on. Welcome in. It's not. It's not working. See. That? Hmm. Yeah. Drawing a winner. Britt Kelly, congrats. You got a hat. All right, let me show you guys real quick. We've got a little bit of sewing stuff over here and crafts. We're going to try that out. But look at this jewelry. It's all silver. I mean, there's some stones over here, obviously, but um, this is all silver jewelry. 925 sterling jewelry. One gold plated in that bracelet, that designer one. Just talking about this right here is a gold plated designer bracelet. Should give you details on that. Um, look at these rings. Some nice stones. Cool stuff. This uh, hat right here is signed by General Waltrip. We figured out who signed that. And there's two of them. One signed, one is not. So we'll just sew them together. We have more of these vintage Cineflex magazines, just like we've done the last couple uh, auctions. These are, I think, well, there's, there are some lithographs in here. Like, I think this is a lithograph. Um, there's some stamps in here. Some this all specialty Disney stuff these people bought. Don't get excited about this. There's no games in these. They're just the cases. But I got a lot of comments from people saying the cases are worth money to collectors. So we're going to give that a shot in auction. All that will be one big lot of the cases. A lot of Disney stuff. Uh, books. Picture frames. Games. Some, some plushies. These games are all sealed brand new. Back here. More Disney plushies. Hats. More hats. And we have a ton of shirts. Cool shirts. Very nice shirts. Mm -hmm. And like we said, mostly double X. Mostly double X. So we're excited, guys. There's extra large too. Okay, let's get this auction started. You want to grab something, Jalen? Sure. Go grab our first item. And another thing uh, we just wanted to share, we'll talk about this a couple times tonight. Uh, oh, Karen says, first time on Whatnot, watch your videos and love them. Thank you so much. Tracy says, love watching your videos on Facebook, but you haven't been showing up on mine lately. Yep, that's Facebook. They, they're messing around with us. And they have for a long time. They don't like our long format. There you go. I'm changing the weight. I'll do it. Just tell me what the weight is. Four to seven. I'm just letting you talk. So, uh, so guys, next week, we, we do our auctions almost every Monday. Next week, we have a little bit different um, uh, spring break for the kids. So we're going to take them and do some stuff. So we're going to do, instead of Monday, next week, we're doing Friday. And Friday is going to be something special. We're doing like a raid train competition with some other storage buyers. Uh, Pirate is putting it together. So details are still to come. I think our slot's at 3 p.m. And um, 
there, I think we're still also working out who's going to be in that, but there'll be at least a, a couple few other people in it. And we're going to have some fun. We have a two hour slot. So we're going to go fast and furious. And next week we're going to release some videos that um, we'll be selling that stuff. And there's some great stuff, new locker, great stuff. It's going to be a really exciting competition. And we're going to probably go fast and furious on that too. We won't be doing like giveaways too much in the beginning. We're going to get right into it because it's competition. So, uh, not this Friday, Carrie, uh, next Friday. So I think it's April 5th. Do you have it on there so they can bookmark it? I do. Okay, great. Yeah, I don't have a thumbnail yet, but uh, it, I did change the date and time. So next week, it's Friday. Okay. You know, oh, great. Thank, oh, wow, look at that. Boba tea. Thank you. Mm, she got her haircut. Yeah. Mm. Nice. That was a lot of inches. Looks good. <laughs> Girls That's always, more than two. Always want to put their, okay, so this right here, it's taped shut. I don't I think that's original. Yeah, I don't think it's been open. open. Couple of uh little mermaid plushies there. Disney. Yep, we have a few of the old new stock of the little mermaid. And here we go. We're gonna start with those. Yeah. It's skewed up. So if you guys are new to these whatnot auctions, it's a 20 second auction. We started a dollar. And uh, it'll move very quick. Let me just get this queued up here. Yeah, April 5th. That's right. Thanks, Mama G. All right. If you guys have any requests, but please let us know if Jack just showed you all the stuff. Okay, we're so running. If there's something you wanted. First lots of little plushies here. All right. Will we have any knives today? No. But this is all Disney, guys. Disney, Disney. In yeah. our next video, which comes out tomorrow morning, so uh, I think in that one I find knives. So that means the next auction will be selling knives. So Bambi Beth, and the skunk right about here. For four bucks. It's a little closer. Let's pull back a little bit. Bambi and the skunk from Bambi right here. Brand new Disney plush. Super cute. Run it. Look how cute Bambi is, and look how cute the little skunk is. They're brand new, guys. Flower. That's right. Thank you, guys. Help me with the names. Bambi and Flower. And they're a little original bag. So cute. Super, super cute. Let's go. Oh, how funny. Kevin got it. Kevin, what's up? Okay. Where are these ones from? Why can't I? Why do I not know which ones these are from? Just a uh, Cinderella. Isn't it? Cinderella. Mice, right? Three little mice. That's right. Sorry, guys. All right, let's go. Disney let's Cinderella. Let's go. Thank you guys for your bids. Thanks for being here. Let us know what you want from what you saw in the lineup. Like Camille Green Eyes. What's up, Camille? We've got a lot of jewelry, blush, lithographs. We got those photo albums. A lot of good stuff. So, if you want the shirts, yeah, she changed. Markney, congrats! All right, this one's super cute. This is Disney little Mickey Mouse baby. He's so so cute. No, uh, one higher. 18, All right, 11. eleven. Yeah, so cute. He's got the Mickey ears. He's a baby Mickey Mouse. He's so cute. I love this plush. All right. Okay. 20 seconds starts now. Baby Mickey. No Disney Lego. We do have a 3D uh, castle puzzle, but no Lego. You know what's really funny about this locker? If you guys have been watching the videos, I put two and two together, some items that I find, which are like, wait a second. The only other time I've ever even seen an item like that was in Mike's video, the pirate. And I asked him, I said, is this guy... Your guy that uh, with the Legos, that really expensive locker, was his last name? I forget the name, Lewis. And he's like, you mean Jeffrey? And I'm like, yeah, I bought the same guy's unit. Different city, different storage facility. Um, same owners, and uh, but no Legos in mine. Not one single Lego. Maybe we had some pieces of Legos. Scully Star, hey, Scully Star Fashions, she was the manager of the place where I bought the units today. Oh, what wow. is up? She'll be in the video. Come, well, it won't be up for a little while, but she, she, uh, she'll be in the video. And thank you so much again for today. That we picked up some great units, and uh, she's a big fan. Isn't that cool? All right, here's Piglet, super cute plushie. He's very cute. I like his little 
fur on him. He's very, very cute. Thank you so much. It says here to support you guys. All right. I appreciate that. Piglet, so cute. Everyone loves Piglet from the gang. Don't make Piglet sad. He's a cute little Piglet. Very, very cute. You to love him, right? Yeah. Good. Any Monster Inc. That's just the shirt I have. Um, I don't think we have any. Do we, did you see any Monster Inc. shirts in here? I don't remember. I saw Buzz Lightyear, Mickey, Night Before Christmas. Yeah. This is this was actually given to us by another of our uh, supporters. Yeah. And Fred. So. If you're watching, thank you. Thumper keychains. No. Huh. I don't think we have any keychains. Tammy got it for six bucks. Congrats. All right, we just have a few more plushies. We have Winnie the Pooh. Let's go, Winnie the Pooh. Vintage shirts. Yeah, we have a whole bunch of shirts. I don't know. We have the, a lot of shirts. I don't know the age on them. Do you guys want the shirts, the lithographs, or the games? We Gregory, also have the hats. Gregory says, found your channel a month ago watching your videos nonstop. Your wife is tired of it. Oh, the wife is tired of it. <laughs> Enjoy your content and humor. Thank you so much. That's funny. Yeah, thank you. I am feeling much better. Shirts. Okay. We can do shirts. Yeah, we can switch to shirts. No problemo. 209 Thrift Bandit. You want the games? We can do the games real quick. That's fine. The boxes. Lithographs, please. All right. Yeah. Getting lots of, lots of requests. That's good. Yeah, it's awesome. All right. I'm going to go ahead and finish these because I only have a couple more left. I'm going to do Tigger. Tigger, Tigger, Tigger. He's so cute. Everybody loves Tigger. Disney tag on Tigger. No fishing items, not tonight. We saw what we find. It just didn't have. I didn't find any fishing stuff recently. Thank you, machine. Thank you guys for your bids. Appreciate you. Have one last Disney plush after this, and we also have the cute hats too. We have some. Oh, we have the Thomas the Train. Why don't we bring that one over here real quick so we finish the plushies? All right, Tigger's going. Oh, how cute! You have a crochet Tigger. How cute! Yeah. <clears throat> this one's. Like super poo, and he has a little mask that he wears above his head. He's so cute. All this is locker finds today. All right, Winnie the Pooh, super poo. Who doesn't love me some super poo? Super poo. He's so cute. Come on. And then we have Thomas the Train with his original tag. It seems a little bit older though. <clears throat> yeah, but we need the poo. That is right. Lisa Dishman, thanks for being here, Lisa. JG by herself says this is the poo bear. All right, so thank Merci. you. Merci. All right, this is uh, Thomas the Train with its original tag on it. He's uh, <laughs> choo chewing away from the locker. When Come on, Thomas the Train, guys. Super cute. Every kid loves Thomas the Train. Boy or girl, Thomas is a classic. Lizzie's asking special. for the empty game cases. All right, we'll do that coming up, too. Yeah, we can do that. No Eeyore. I don't think we found one. Oh, I know. I love Eeyore. He's so cute. We have some pins. We have the beautiful frames that are new. The Buzz Lightyear Toy Story one still is in the, has the original box. Do you guys want those frames? Let us know. They're very nice. All right, Thomas is going. He's almost gone. He sold. All right. All right. This is a Disney photo mosaics. It's by Robert Silver Silvers. It's a puzzle and it includes a fold out poster for assembly. Super, super cool. Still sealed. It has a little bowing on the box, but uh, still sealed. It's a thousand piece puzzle. Winnie the Pooh, and it's so cute. We're running. All right, sealed Winnie the Pooh thousand piece puzzle. We're probably gonna get through our stuff quick tonight. Quick. Was this the same? That's fine. Huh? Same way on all these. Uh, I know this one. I didn't. I didn't. Did. <coughs> I think they're all gonna be different. That uh, the one I got is the same. I made it. All right, guys, thank you for your bids. Winnie the Pooh a puzzle with a fold out poster. All right. Next up, I have a Disney Princess 3D puzzle, which is super cool. Yeah, that's the castle. All right, sold. 
Joker Smile says, glad you're feeling better trying to catch up on your locker videos. Thank you so much. All right, this one does have a little creasing on the box, as you can see. It's a 3D puzzle, Cinderella, Cinderella's Castle. Super cute, 3D puzzle. That's really nice. Those cool. are cool. No. So we're gonna go ahead and run that. All right, 3D puzzles going. I've been buying up a storm on lockers lately. You have? Yeah, bought th th the three today. You want to do the interior? Only bought one. Oh, thanks for the Gambit statue. Great packaging. Oh, good. I'm glad that got there in one piece. You never know. You know, this post office, they fight us. They fight us. I have a game ready to go, Jen. Okay, great. Sold, sold, sold. Okay, sold. <clears throat> this one's a nice one. These are expensive. This is a light sealed game and it's in really nice condition and it's Pirates of the Caribbean, the world's end, totally nice. I'm sure the weight's different on this one. So, all right, ages nine and up, super nice. I'm gonna change the weight. Oops, I thought it was four pounds. Okay. Travel to the ends of the world, two to six players, still sealed life game, Pirates of the Caribbean. Right here, we're going. This is four pounds, so is that okay? Five then? pounds. Okay. All right, sealed right here. Life Pirates of the Caribbean, beautiful condition. That ages nine and up, guys. This has some really good value. Steel sealed, beautiful condition on the box. Let's go, let's go. Thank you for your bids. Oh, that was a great deal. Nine bucks, good deal. My goodness. All right, you guys asked for these empty cases, so here they are. I can show them to you, um, but they all are empty. So you can see, um, as Jack said, a lot of people have the games, uh, but don't have the cases, so there's definite value in just a the lot cases. Of have the books too, but a few of them don't. All right. I would say most of them have the game uh, booklets in them. Okay. All right, I'm gonna just show them to you all. But as you say, a lot of people find the video games, um, but not. There's two boxes. Mario D uh, Mario Kart DSs. There's two Super Mario Makers. I think they had a couple kids and probably had duplicates so the kids could play head to head. Uh, how much is shipping on the puzzle? Probably eight thirty-five because it was under five pounds. So anything over, or uh, let's go this way so they can see all the titles. Like that. And if you could just hold them. Yeah. All right, guys, there's all our titles. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 23, plus one little one. So just about 24 boxes. Like I said, most of them have the, the booklets in them, not all of them. They all are super clean. Oh, yeah, they're in beautiful condition. And, again, there is value in the cases, so bid, bid, bid. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Linda. Linda's saying it should tell you the shipping costs. You can go in after and still see the shipping costs. You want to grab the Toy Story frames? Maybe those are five pounds, too. I think those nuts. I'm going to go this one. Thanks, everyone, for being here. We got some great jewelry coming up. I'm going to do some Disney stuff, and then we'll get to some of the jewelry. Thank you for your bids in these cases. Give me some boba. Give me some boba. All right, we are sold. All right. Lizzie, congrats, 33. Sold for 33. All right, next up we have a beautiful... Disney, this was still brand new wrapped. I took it out of all the original packaging. You can tell, look at that, super nice. This one has the original box with it. It is um, Action Heroes, Toy Story, and it's a three and a half by five and a half picture frame. <clears throat> super nice. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and run that now. Thank you. I'm gonna have one more, the princess one, if you wanna get that one up next. Yeah. The Toy Story. And this is so cute. The dinosaurs wearing 
the Disney ears and then it has them eating like the Minnie Mouse uh, ice cream. These are beautiful. These are very nice. Yeah, they're the three dimensional. Mm -hmm. And this one's gorgeous. Come on, guys. It's a brand new frame, guys. Brand new. Disney. Sweet Honeybee says, hello, everyone. My first time watching you. Awesome. Thank yeah, Sam so is wearing his hat. That's a good call. Uh, Sold 10 bucks. 10 bucks. What a good deal. And a new buyer. Hike goalie. Thank Congrats. You. All right. This one is everyone's favorite. Still has the sticker on it. Um, princesses. Disney Princess Club. Super pretty. Sparkly castle with all the ladies lined up. We got a whole bunch of silver jewelry coming up later tonight. I'll try to do what people are requesting first. And we have a lot of jewelry, mm -hmm. a lot of sterling. They asked for the lithographs. So should we do those or the t-shirts? They asked for both. Um, whatever. We have a lot of t-shirts. So we can do the lithographs and then the t-shirts. I don't care. 15 sold. Congratulations, shirts. Congrats. All right, I'll run some shirts. Graphs, shirt. You know what we'll do? We'll do a few shirts and a few little graphs. Oh, little graphs. How's that? Because <clears throat> there's a lot of shirts. Okay, <clears throat> I'm gonna try to go decent speed on these. So you want to do eight to eleven on them, or twelve to fifteen on the shirts? Mm -hmm. uh, twelve to fifteen, since they're double X. It'd be a little bit. <clears throat> it'd be right on the line there. So. All right. First one is uh, Disney kicking it old school. This one's so cute. I love it. A lot of these are from the Disney store or Disneyland. This one is a 2X. I didn't see any holes or anything. There's nothing on the back. It's black, 2X. No knives tonight, but next week we should have knives. So bookmark our next show. It'll be a competition, but we uh, find knives in our next video. No, they're not all 2X. Just, um, but I'll, I'll read the size off on each one. This one is though, okay? Kicking it old school. We are going Disney. Super cute. You got Mickey with his little chain and his beatbox. This one's very cool. I love it. Gregory, next week we bought a, a very interesting locker. Um, there'll be some pocket knives. There'll be some. Uh, the guy had like concert tickets. I'm trying to remember exactly what he had. I think we found a little bit of coins. Are we sold? But they had just some cool stuff. Nine bucks. The MC countries, countries. Congrats. All right. We got another Disney. This one's an extra large Disney, and it's the night before Christmas, Nightmare Before Christmas. The Pumpkin King, Tim Burton's black. And this one is an extra large. Extra large, not a double X, a little extra large. The next one is doesn't have a tag on it, but it looks the same as this one. I'd say it's an extra large too. But. <clears throat> extra large nightmare before Christmas. Let's go. And what lithographs? Yeah, you can see the tag. It's from the Disney store on this one. Most of them are, like I said, from the Disney store or um, Disney Studio or Walt Disney World or Disneyland. <clears throat> All right, six bucks sold. There's a tag on that one. Walt Disney World. Scully, congrats. This one's an extra large. Extra large. And this one's Disney's <laughs> Animal Kingdom. How do you say happy birthday to me? Safari. You're a couple months early to pad these, but thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> extra large on that one from Disney. Maybe he's saying happy belated to me, to Jana, but he did say happy birthday, Jack. Mm -hmm. Kilimanjaro safaris. Yeah, this one's cool. Oh my gosh, a buck! Wow. Uh oh, good. Brick Kelly. Okay, we should probably switch up. Shirts are bombing, but let's ring the bell. We do the bell for the dollar sales, and someone's payment didn't go through. Hopefully, it was that one. Okay. <laughs> Brick Kelly, if that was your payment that didn't go through, you have till the end of the show to uh, update the card or whatever. All right, we're gonna start. We're gonna come back to the shirts, and we're gonna do the lithograph. This one is um, a two disc special edition. Um, these are in really nice condition for lockers. It's kind of crazy. 
So this is a 2004 exclusive Disney lithograph portfolio. Okay, printed in the USA. All right, and it looks like there's more than two. So, so we have this one, this one, and this one. So there's three of them. Three lithographs, and it comes in this envelope. Four, actually. Yeah, there we go. We got Jasmine, Aladdin. I think it says two discs, so it probably came with a um, DVD or something. It's some kind of promotional thing. I don't know. Yeah. Neither do I. It says discs. So. so 2004. Four Aladdin lithographs. 20 years old and in really nice condition. Okay. Hey, we're going to start at a book. Started at a book. 12 to 15 ounces on these? Yeah, it's the hard thing is going to be when we uh, ship it, we've got to put cardboard in the large envelope, you know? So it should be a pound, right? No? I think I accounted for it, so. Um, oh, I don't know. Britt, I don't know if we can check it on our side. Britt Kelly. All right, guys. Lithograph 2004 Disney. Okay, thanks, Mama G. She's saying it's all good. We have a lot of different lithographs tonight. Get the Lion King coming up next. Okay. All right, sold. Sold. Hunting Lost Traders, congrats. Congratulations. All right. Okay, beautiful presentation on that, too. Okay. All right, next one. This is a special edition Lion King. Super beautiful right here. And this is from the Disney Store Lithograph. Um, very, very nice. I don't see a year anywhere, but I'll look. These are also printed in the USA. And this is so cute. I love the artwork to this. Oh, my gosh. These are beautiful. So cute. Who doesn't love the Lion King? I love the Lion King. Akuna Matata. So four lithographs there too. Yeah. Starts at a buck. Any from American Tail. I don't remember seeing that. I don't think I looked through all of them too close. We have Lady in the Tramp. Bambi. Quite a few Lady in the Tramps. Lady in the Tramp. Like, yeah, a bunch of those. The Lion King ones are so cute. So, so cute. Mm. Yeah, the lady in the tramp is nice. It's a cast member lithograph. Yeah, I know. I saw that. That's I was like, it's so cool. It. 15 bucks, Ricky Kroll. All right. Thank you so Congrats. much. All right. All right, next, this one is Lady in the Tramp, and this one's really special. It's the exclusive cast member lithograph. Um, so this was exclusively produced for cast members of the Disney store who successfully met a special video challenge in 2001. Oh, so kind of cool. And, uh, I believe it's just the one. Yeah. So here it is. This is a special exclusive cast member lithograph for a special promotion in 2001. I was thinking maybe they worked at the Disney store. So. I don't know. They, I think, owned a timeshare or did some or some membership to their travel clubs too. So found a lot of Disney travel, like booklets and stuff. Any Land Before Time? Uh, I don't think I saw that either. All right, guys, this is the Cars, Little Mermaid, Bambi, yeah. Lady in the Tramp, Lion King. This is the cast member one, guys, right here. Super cool. Beautiful condition on this one. Look at that artwork. It's so pretty. All right, sold. So for eight bucks. Somebody's asking for Bambi. All right, I'll get that up. All right, Lady and the Tramp, 50th anniversary edition. This is beautiful artwork. Look at Lady and the Tramp. So cute. And then look at the cats that mm. like cut out like that. And this is the 50th anniversary ones. So beautiful. I love it. And look at that. Oh, my gosh. I love the one of the cats. 
And again, the condition on these are really nice. Very, very, like, unusually nice for something we find in a locker. Usually they're all scrubbed up. All right. Okay. It's running. Lady and the Tramp, 50th anniversary. Yeah, I know the Siamese cat one. So cute. Yeah, Mama G, of course. <laughs> well, we can start for you. <laughs> Tomorrow night, guys, uh, Tuesday nights, uh, second week in a row, Mama G's having an, an auction here on Whatnot. So this is the second week in a row, Tuesday night. And uh, she's saying book market is 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. All so right, make sure so. you guys bookmark that. And you can do that by clicking on her. And make sure you follow her, and then you can pull up her channel and uh, bookmark that as well. Okay. All right, Ricky Kroll, congrats. All right, Bambi right here. Look how pretty this artwork is on the back with the flowers. So, so pretty. Special edition. Beautiful artwork of the pond and Bambi. Oh, my gosh. Look how pretty these are. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is so beautiful. I love this one. Flower, Bambi, Thumper. All right. So these ones are very, very pretty. All right. We're running them. I know they're so cute. And we also have ones with stamps. Ooh. We have like a very, oh, yeah, that one's cool. Mm. We have really cool stamps, um, Disney stamps. Yeah, there's some cool stuff. They're asking how you ship these. These I would put uh, cardboard on each side and then get a large envelope. I think that's the best way to do it because I can't roll them or fold them. So we're going to have to cardboard them up and then put them in a bubble, big bubble envelopes. I think we have some big enough for that. These are beautiful. Pickle particles, congrats. Beautiful, beautiful. Enjoy. All right. We also have the Lion King stamps. They're like first issue stamps. Disney, they're really cool too. When I get, uh, like when I buy bubble wrap or anything large, I get large boxes. I take my razor and I cut the panels out. So I have a lot of big pieces of cardboard, which is great for cutting the size and putting on each side of these. Protecting it. It's fun. All right. Next up, I have Disney's Lady in the Trap. This is, comes in a super cool envelope. Really beautiful artwork. And look at that. It's a Disney store exclusive right here. That's what it says on the back of that. 50th that, anniversary. That is so cool. It's a lenticular, right? That's awesome. All right, guys. Very cool. We also have cars. I know it's holographic. That one's super cool. And again, condition on this is really nice. If you know someone that likes Disney stuff, please tag them in our show. We still have Disney Disney shirts, hats, games, and more lithographs. So, super pumped. All right. Thank you guys for your bids. Appreciate it. Oh, my gosh. You guys are funny. All right. Is that one sealed? That one's sealed, but it's not the lady in the trip. So awesome. You want it? Sure. Oh, you mix it up. Okay. And move on. That okay. So Ricky Crow, congrats again. This one's Lady in the Tramp, and this one is sealed. Is sealed. So this is pretty cool. I think this is the only sealed one I have. Here's all four of the pictures. They're different than the other ones. So you can see the cat. And then this is all sealed. Really cool. These are four lithographs. And then it's sealed in this beautiful packaging. <clears throat> still sealed. All four lithographs, guys, sealed still. Walt Disney, and you can see those are the four lithographs inside. Super cute. Disney still sealed. Thank you. We have the stamps coming up next. We can do that. That'd be great. All right. Uh, those are just all the COAs for each one. So do them all together? I think so. I mean, I think they're kind of valuable, but like, I think it's fine to do it all together. It makes more sense. <clears throat> all right. 
Sold. Congratulations. Ricky Crow, congrats again. All right. This is the only one like that I have this. It's the first day of issue stamps. Has the COA with them. Right here. First day canceled stamps. There's two sets. Two sets. I have two COAs right here. I have. It's first day of issue. What's it called? First day of issue? Yeah. Actually, these are, oh, this was separate. First day cancel stamps. <clears throat> this is all this and this is that, but I guess we can do it all together. It's fine. All right. There's two sets here. Okay, guys. So these are, you've got the Pinocchio, you've got Lion King, you've got Bambi with the original canceled stamp and then it's stamp first day of issue. Look at that Mickey and friends. 2004. 2004 on that. And then I also have friendship. So there's another four here. And then we have Lion King. Pinocchio, and this is super cool. Look at the, the this is all 2004. They're 20 years old, guys. So <clears throat> super cool. It's got its little number here. This one's still sealed. Has all the original packaging from the United States Postal Office right here. And then there's another. Oh, there's another COA right. Oh yes, right here. And then two COAs. Okay. So in total, you're getting four first day issue canceled ones. Four in two different sets and then four on the other so eight total <coughs> I'm gonna add just a little yep. bit on this one because it's a bigger the and there's two yeah okay I guess 20 seconds <clears throat> all right coas with the original envelopes as well any sterling silver stud earrings I don't see any we do have a few silver earrings but no stud earrings right Joe there's a couple studs to the very right. Like that? Mm -hmm. This. <clears throat> All right, we're sold. That was a good deal, I think. 39. All right. Mark me. Congrats. Okay, next. All right. Next, next, next. Cinderella. Cinderella. Everyone loves the princesses. Cinderella, dressed in yellow. Here you go. All right, Cinderella, this one is a special edition. And let's see if it has a year on here. Doesn't, but beautiful artwork. Cinderella was the first princess movie I ever saw. I remember seeing it after school. They played it in our school gym for us after school with the projector and they gave us popcorn. It's kind of a big deal. All right, these are beautiful. Oh my gosh. Guys, these are in gorgeous condition. All right. <clears throat> these are so pretty. Hello. Welcome in, Keith. Hey, Keith. Thanks for being here. Okay, did you show them? Yeah. Okay, we're going to start at 20 seconds. All right, guys. Special edition right here. Disney lithographs. These are so cool. <clears throat> these are really, really neat. I love the princess ones. So nice. <clears throat> All right. What else do we have? I would say our next um, our next video, which drops tomorrow morning, starts out slow. That's the one that you were there. It's the one we bought for thousand fifty. Okay. And then it gets really good. The deeper I, we, I get in this unit, the better it gets. That's cool, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, the presentation's beautiful on that. This this Cinderella one's gorgeous, guys. Absolutely gorgeous. <clears throat> After these, we'll do the Cineflex books, and then we'll come back to some more Disney later. Keith got it. Congrats. <clears throat> yeah, congrats. That one's beautiful. I love it. Next one in is Cars. I love the prep. Um, here. I love the presentation on all these. The Cinderella one was special edition. Okay, this is 2006. <clears throat> right here comes with the original official envelope. And this is from the creators of Incredibles and Finding Nemo. And look at that. What a presentation. Look at that. With all the cars. That's so cool. This is a beautiful piece. Right here with all the cars. Isn't that cool? Oh, yeah. That's a neat one. And then the lithographs are here. All right. Four lithographs. And the beautiful presentation. All right, guys. Mm. We're going to start it. 20 seconds. <clears throat> All right, cars, lithograph. This one's got a great presentation to it. Beautiful condition. 
Yeah, those you can do color if you want. Mm -hmm. I think that's best. Do you want to do it? I don't know. I don't. I just put it there in case you wanted to. We have a Blue Man Group poster that's like still sealed. Is anyone? A, I think it's like a program you get when you go see them. Yeah, and it's a poster they sold. All right, that is beautiful. Enjoy that. Super cool. All right, you got it. Congrats. All right, the next one I have is oh, let's do the lady in trap one first. Real okay, because we'll finish those lithographs and then we'll do those last ones. Oh yeah, that one's cool. It's Walt Disney. All right, this is Lady and the Tramp. This is a collection of six fine art lithographs. Okay, so I think these are a little nicer. This is a collection of six fine art lithographs. All right, this one's beautiful. And these actually have some writing on them. They have like framed, uh, really, really neat. These are, these are a little thicker too. All right, six of them. And these are very beautiful. Okay, you wanna run them? Let's run them. Oh my gosh, and the classic. Mm. Okay, so these are six fine art ones, and they, they actually running. have the titles with them. Really, really nice. Do I have a jewelry bust for sale? No. I have a really pretty opal heart necklace. I have some really beautiful pendants. I have like a French queen that's all silver. That's super cool. Oh, great deal on that one. $27, guys. Wow, that one's really, that was neat. All right, we have Little Mermaid coming up next. You're not going to want to miss Ariel. She's an all-time favorite princess. Everyone loves Little Mermaid. Beautiful, vibrant colors. All right, gorgeous presentation with that. Oh, my gosh, with the blue. Super, super pretty. All right. <clears throat> There's a set of four on this. These are gorgeous. All right, we're running it. <clears throat> All four of these are no Rapunzel, unfortunately. I have one with Walt Disney. I'm Finding Nemo, and then I have one more Aladdin. You can do that Aladdin and Jasmine one first. Thank you so much. Yeah, this mermaid one's so pretty. I was sick like two weeks ago, and then Jack got sick, and then I think I got a little bit of what he had back. Um, I'm fine, but, um, I think I've just been really busy, so things are just rolling. Keith, and, congrats. You know, sometimes that happens. All right, here is the Walt Disney 1993. This is the co exclusive commemorative one. So this one's a little different. 1993, guys. So this is 31 years old. 31 years old, 1993. Does have a little wrinkle on the corner. I just want to point that out. That otherwise in really nice condition, beautiful. Jasmine and Aladdin commemorative edition right here. 1993, 31 years old. Hmm. All right. Super pretty. Yeah, that's neat, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, the Finding Nemo does not have an, an envelope. There's only two. So let's put them with these. Okay. And we'll this do this a separate. lot. Yeah. We also have some 50th anniversary baseball hats that are Disney and the Disney caps. And we have some Disney pins. So let us know what you guys want. Then we have, um, like I said, the jewelry, some more games. The games are sealed. Sticks Picks, what's up? Hey, Sticks Picks. Thanks what's for up? being here. Yeah. I'll be at the flea market on Wednesday. At least that's the plan. But I think you guys won't be there. All right, sold. Um, Hunting Lost Treasures, congrats. All right. So this one's going to be a bit of a <clears throat> cool deal. You're getting Beauty on the Beast book from Ice. This is gorgeous. Beautiful condition, Beauty on the Beast. Uh, Broadway musical. These I know can have some real value with the original tickets and the Lion King book. This is gorgeous, Lion King. 100 Years of Magic on this one for Disney. And this is kind of going to be like a real great value. And then two Finding Nemo 
lithographs. Look at the colors on that. This one's big bucks here, guys. We're doing it all in one, all in one to make it move a little faster because we got a lot. So we have Disney on Ice, The Lion King, actual Broadway musical, and Sleeping Beauty. And then you're getting these two Finding Nemo. So <clears throat> this has a lot of value. So it's good, good stuff. All right. Thank you so much. A lot of good stuff. Keith, congrats. Yeah, we're almost done on those. And then our last ephemera piece of Disney is, this is really cool. This is the 50th anniversary. Um, and this is a 19, this is a, <clears throat> a commemorative lithograph of Walt Disney. Look at that, guys. Black and white commemorative lithograph of Walt Disney in front of the Princess Castle. So they did this for the 50th anniversary of Disney. This is off the hook, super cool. Out of all the pieces, we're doing this by itself. Okay. All right. Thank you. We'll do this later. All right. I have Disney pins and the Disney hats. I have games, or we can go back. We can do the Cineflex books. I can only do a couple of those. We can do those. No one's asked for those, but we should do these because it's all in the same. Sure. What's the other one on the table? Is that one you need to go? It's just an envelope. Oh, okay. Right. I think it goes to that. It's just a little Okay. And this is the Walt Disney commemorative lithograph for the 50 years. Uh, why don't we, I can do the 50 year hats real quick and then I'll do that one. You want me to? Let's kind of go with the 50 year theme. All right. Paladin Comics, what's up? Congrats on that. 31 bucks. Right. So. And these, um, is H11 good on this too, babe? I believe so. Okay. All right, guys. So we have 50th anniversary, Disneyland, not worn, brand new. These all have like the little stickers and tags all in them. I have three new. I'm going to do um, this one first. Fifth, this is a beautiful black Disney official 50th anniversary hat. So let's run it. Super nice, beautiful condition. We're running it. Yeah, good to be here. Thanks for being here. All right, guys, 50 years. Disney right here, still with the tag on it. Hat. Embroidered, guys. This is a very nice. Look at the embroidery on that. Yeah, if there's a little fuzz on this part because they had it in with the shirts and the stuffies. It's also just the lighting. It blows it up tremendously. When I see it through my eyes here, it doesn't look as fuzzy. All right, three bucks. I'll take those. To the <laughs> Sounds good. <clears throat> okay. So I also have the Mickey Mouse ears. And then I have some pens. Okay. I'm going to run the pens real quick. And then I have a little bit more artwork. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I have the 50th anniversary Tinkerbell. One to three ounces on this one. 50th anniversary Disney pen right here with Tink. Beautiful condition. Walt Disney Travel Company. This is Tinkerbell. Brand new in the bag. Super cute. Disney pen. All right. Thank you guys for your bids. Everyone loves me the Tinkerbell. Yeah. Yeah, they had a, the, a lot of the 50th uh, anniversary pieces. Which was like, what, 2005 or something? I think it was a while ago. Maybe, the yeah. The 50th anniversary. So this one's special. This is the Little Mermaid one. Keith, really, congrats. really nice on this one. This is a collector's one. I didn't even look at the value, but I know the Little Mermaid. This is an older one. We're going to go ahead and run it. Beautiful <clears throat> collector's Disney Little Mermaid not worn, not used, pen. Super nice. Oh, she's the video on that one. Yeah, she likes that redhead. All right, super cute. Ariel, let's go. Mr. Big Cookie, hello. Thanks for being here. What's up, Clint? Sold. All right, I got one more 50th travel. This is Mickey with the castle. Super cute AAA pen. This is a collectible pen right here. It's running with the castle and Mickey. Great colors on this one. 50th anniversary, Mickey and the castle. Running that. 
All right. Nikki, it's our only Nikki one tonight. And then I have a, a larger group of pens. All right, sold. Good. All right, I have one Good. more Tinkerbell for the 50th anniversary. And I have a lanyard. Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh lanyard with flowers. I'm going to give you both just because I'm feeling the love. Let's do it. Let's make it fun. You get the Winnie the Pooh lanyard, which is really pretty, and the tank. Two for one on this. So let's bid, bid, bid it up. <coughs> Tinkerbell and the lanyard, guys. Let's go. <coughs> All right, thank you guys. You get two for one on this lanyard and tink. So, so cute. All right, we're just about sold. Thank you so much. Seven, congrats. Okay. All right, we have two more lithographs here. All right. And these have a COA on them. They are Jean-Claude Picot. And they're from 2005, and they have a registered number and a stamp, a stamp from the director. And here's one with the graph signed, and it comes with some information about the. So it looks like that is signed. <clears throat> yeah, by the, like the live signature on that one. And then, <clears throat> are we doing them separate or together? No, we'll do them together. Okay. And then here's another one from the same gallery, but look at that. Super cool sign. It's really cool, actually. Yeah. It's really neat. So both signed, both with COAs. We didn't do any research on these. Nope. Um, so kind of a fun opportunity to get two signed pieces of art. Really pretty. Yeah, both with COAs, right? COAs, yeah. And actual signatures on these guys, okay? Really pretty. I'm going to... Really, really. Look at that, guys. That's gorgeous. Look at the signature on that. Two signed art pieces. You want to do these buttons? <clears throat> sure. And then there's this one. All right, eight bucks. What a deal. It's the same way. You want to do that? Eight okay. bucks. Good, good pick up there. All right. This All next right. one is from our same collector. We've got the Storyteller Cafe Critter Breakfast Toontown, which is no longer in existence. So this has some good collectability to it. It's gone. Yeah. Honorary Citizen. And then some Plaza and the Minis. And then a birthday one. And then another Toontown. So Minis. you got a lot in here. So <clears throat> we're just going to blow it all out at once. We're moving and grooving tonight. I think you get three... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. You get a dozen pens on this. <clears throat> a dozen. So super cute. Storyteller Cafe. I think the Toontown ones are probably the most valuable because there's no more Toontown. <clears throat> All right. The Toontown ones are really cute. <coughs> Who wants jewelry? Let me know. I have some Disney um, Disney books, too. We have a whole set of nice books. We can do those as well. They're so shiny. It's hitting the light kind of funny. Sorry about that. Yes, jewelry. Okay. We'll be getting into jewelry shortly. We, um, before we get to the jewelry, let me know if anyone else wants the sun effects or the Disney books or the games. Disney, the Disney books she's talking about are these. They're really nice. It's old whole bunch of these uh, children's wonderful world of reading books. Yeah, they're really nice. So it's a five pound. Yeah, I have more shirts. I'll do those. You're right. I got yeah. them right here. If anybody wants these books, let us know. Disney books. We're at 12 to 15, so I'll just do a couple more shirts. All right, guys. So let's see. Let's do, like I said, I think they worked at um, the Disney store because they had so many. All right, this one's a... Epic Mini, The Power of Two with the Pink Brush. This is a 2X, maybe the light, if we could turn it down a little. All right, right here, Black 2X, Epic Mickey 2 with the Power of Two. Really cool with the paintbrush. This one's neat. I like this one. 
Uh, we're going to sell the books all in one lot for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you're interested, just let us know. Yeah. All right. Double X Mickey with the pink brush. Super cute shirt. Epic Mickey. Power of two. Most of these were either purchased at the resort or at the Disney store. So. All right. <clears throat> Next one I have coming up is from Disney World tag, and that is a Goofy Shirts on Deck. And that one is an extra large. <clears throat> Sold. Kevin. Kevin, congrats. Congratulations, Kevin. Thank you. Okay, this one is an extra large. Here's the tag on it. You asked to see the tag, so there you go. You're welcome. America. This one is Grizzly Run Ride Take a Ride on the Wild Side. I love this one. This one's from the actual <coughs> Disney land. All right, so we're going to go ahead and run it. It's an extra large. Extra large. Take a ride. Super cute. It's goofy, guys. Or He's so cute. Come on. Don't be leaving Goofy out. Okay, we're going to do my favorite shirt next. <clears throat> and it's from the Disney Studio Collection. So cool. I love this one, guys. This one's really nice quality. This one's beautiful. All right. I also have Mickey Mouse large pajama like pants if you guys want these these are so cool they're really cool large mickey mouse uh pajama pants all right seven months the countries old. congrats all right my favorite shirts coming up guys this one's from the studio collection really nice stitching really nice um quality on this one this one is an extra large and it's beautiful I love this one. I like this one too. Yeah. It, and that's why I highlighted it on our mannequin because it's so cool. There we go. Okay. Super cool, extra large, and great condition. Love it. This is part of the studio collection. And it's running. Yeah, I know it does, right? It's that's exactly it's it's really nice. The collar, the stitching, it's like got a really nice stitching on the sides. It's a very well-made shirt. Super nice. Yeah. We have those signed hats too. Well, yeah. One signed, the other one is not. We're going to sell them together. If you guys want that, let us know. Pens Oil Racing. Pair of hats. All right. Hey, Darlene. Hey, Darlene. <clears throat> All right. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, that is a cool shirt. Yeah, it's cool. We have some Disney pajamas in there. I'm trying to see what else we have. All right. <clears throat> All right, we're sold. Darling got it, 19 bucks. Good Darlene, deal. I love that one. Enjoy it. Okay, Nightmare Before Christmas, 2X on this one. 2X, this is Tim Burton's. This one is... From Touchstone Pictures out of Giant Merchandising from California. has the original tag on it. So this is a very nice one. Super cool. Double X. Um, really, really nice. We're running it. <clears throat> Everyone loves The Nightmare Before Christmas. So popular. So... All right. <clears throat> Tim Burton's A Nightmare Before Christmas. Julie's heart's winning. Woohoo. Thank you guys so much for your bids. Sold. Julie, thank you so much. And Enjoy congrats. That one, Julie. I love it. I love it. All right. This one's an extra large and it has the tag from the resort. Right there is a resort. I love it. It's a patriotic one. It's Disneyland Resort. It's American tradition. And this one's in really good condition. Very nice quality. And it is a extra large from the resort. 
has the nice, nice tag on it. Look at that. I have not found the blue footy pajamas yet. They might be in a box for the market or they may have already gone to the market. I don't know. There's so much stuff. I've been processing a lot of stuff. You guys have seen the video, the first two episodes on this locker, but after that I've bought one, two, three. I've gone through four more lockers since then. <laughs> All right, it's old. All right. Let's see, uh Seeklahoma resale shop. Congrats. Double extra large on this, guys. These are all, this is from the Disney store. A lot of these are 15 years plus old, early 2000s. The original Donald, this one's sweet. Has a retro look to it. Really, really cool. Double X from the Disney store. Double X, cool colors on that. Very cool colors. <clears throat> Southeast Oklahoma. Okay. Oh, got it. All right. <laughs> now it makes sense. All right. I think those will just take Any plush. Answer. We already did the plush. We had a bunch yeah, of Disney we plush. Did. We did it early and they went cheap. Too. Phoenix Rose, congrats. 13. That one was cool. All right. We got one more Disney shirt. And then, oh, I have a whole stack over there. What the heck? Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Oh, what's this guy called here? The family guy? Yeah, I think it's Stewie. I have one family guy shirt if anyone wants it. All right, Buzz Lightyear. This one's a double X. This one's super cool. Again, a lot of these are from the Disney Store early 2000s. This one's really cool. Really nice shape. Double X, extra large, Disney Store, Buzz Lightyear. That one's cool. I really think they worked at the Disney Store. How could they not have this much stuff? Right? They didn't. <clears throat> they didn't. They had money. Huh. Oh, I got a Dark Vader one. That one's cool. <clears throat> oh, I have a Monster Inc. one. We do. Who asked? Um, <clears throat> That's I don't awesome. Know, I don't, no one asked. I think they asked for Toy Story because <clears throat> I'm wearing the Monster Inc. No. But they were asking for Monster They're asking Inc. for Toy Story. <clears throat> That's what we got right here, guys. This is your chance. Um, Scal the Banco, our friend Scal the Banco. <clears throat> also known as auction expeditions is um he was fast tracked by using our link for whatnot and uh tomorrow's first show at 4 p.m so that's awesome 4 p.m tomorrow guys if you can go support him so tomorrow's gonna be an action-packed day we got we got auction expeditions at four and we got mama g at five two great auctions tomorrow night have some fun kathy won that one for 16 congrats kathy. all right guys you asked for it I think this one's a 2X. I cannot tell. I'm guessing or an extra large. This one's sick. I bring the um, the whole package. Uh, this one's great, funny. guys. Funny. Love this one. This one's awesome. I love this one. Next up, I got from Star Wars Disney. This one. This one's cool. Yeah, it's cool, huh? Expressions of Vader. <laughs> Honey, you have a lot of shirts. It's okay. I need more shirts. Oh, my. <clears throat> All right, Monsters, Inc. Must have shirts. Monsters, Inc. Uh, oh, what were you asking, Mom G? The 2X was a Donald. Yeah. All right, guys, Monsters, Inc.'s here. This one's sick. I love this. <clears throat> Super cool. Okay. Cat Jor, congrats. Enjoy. Bon appetit. Okay, guys, this has an original Star Wars tag. This one's kind of got some money to it. Look at that. This is a 2X. Look at that. Star Wars tag, expressions of Vader. Angry, happy, sad, sleepy, confused, proud, excited, frustrated, cheerful. All the same expression. Jack is Darth Vader. Expressions of Vader with the cool tag. This one's awesome. Beautiful condition, you guys. Come on. Let's go. That's Lord Vader, says Jeff Cameron. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love it. You gotta show him respect. Awesome. Oh, took you out. Oh my gosh, honey. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Let's go. All right. 
Yes, welcome in through. Cheryl loves Paris. Congrats. All right, that's a nice shirt. Have I ever seen the movie? Which movie? Star Wars? <clears throat> yes, of course. She's seen a couple times. A lot of times. Um, okay, this <laughs> one's another Disney store that one. Two X. I don't know about that. My dad watched it a lot. This one's super cool. The young kids would love this. This is a total great resell shirt or buy. The paint splatter, totally youngins. What's love that? Two X. Two XL. Two X Disney store early two thousands. This one's cool. I love this one. I was like right away. I'm like ah. Oh. This one would do well. <clears throat> do well. We got a few more shirts, and then we got a lot of jewelry, guys. Oh my gosh, I have so much jewelry. I have some seriously beautiful pendants. Show them that coin, the French coin. Solid silver, guys. We also have these Cineflex magazines. Yay, Kevin. If you've uh, been in the last you? couple auctions, we sell these. They are mostly from the early 2000s, and these are some expensive magazines this guy uh, subscribed to. This is $12.50 for this one book, and this one's got Spider-Man 3, Pirates 3, Children of Men, Mimsy, and Next. So it's a like a movie aficionado okay, guys, magazine. This is not, this is not your basic Kevin. Disney store. It's organic, guys, for all you youngins that only want organic cotton. Department, Department of, Nightmares. of Nightmares, undeniably devious. This is very cool. Huge following for this nightmare before Christmas. <clears throat> I'm not into it, but a lot of people are. But I respect it. I do. Right. Size on that is double XL. Double XL, organic cotton on that, organic cotton. Okay. Nightmare Before Christmas. <clears throat> Which one is this? Which dwarf is that? Do you know? Grumpy. Is it grumpy? Sure you don't want to keep that? <coughs> For you? No. No? Okay. DJ Mix but, Factory, congrats. Because no one describes me as grumpy. Nice. <clears throat> Here you go. Depends on the day. No, there's no day. Depends on the day. So 3X from the Disney store. This one's in really nice condition. It's grumpy. He is in, this one's very clean. 3X Disney store. Really nice gray. Not not really anywhere on this one. Happy dance. Good. Congrats. <laughs> All right. Grumpy. Julie's hearts when you do I know everyone's going for Grumpy. Everyone loves Grumpy. He's like, he's epic, right? <clears throat> he's a rock star. All yeah. right. So, Lorema, congrats. Yeah, congrats. Cool, cool. <clears throat> All right, just a few more shirts left. <clears throat> this one's really nice. It's another organic cotton from the Disney store, Double X, with the earth on it. And Mickey and his hands, and it's got all these cool earth tone, you know, colors. Really nice. Organic cotton, double X. <clears throat> Organic cotton. Ooh, the next one's Iron Man. That's cool. Organic cotton. Mickey is a classic. Mickey's saving the world with his organic cotton shirts. Right here. Super cool. Just a few more shirts left. Thanks, you guys, for being here. We got so much great jewelry. We got the Disney. Does anyone want the Clue Monopoly Steel Sealed Games? And then the Mickey hats. Let us know. The ears. Right. Jumpy 2003, congrats. Yeah, congrats. All right. Oh, this is great. The back of the shirt. All right. Invincible Iron Man. This one's really nice. It's a triple X, a double X, sorry. But not a huge double X. It's a double X red with Iron Man from the Disney store. This one's really nice. The red's beautiful. Thanks for the follows, guys, if you're in there and you're following us. Why does it look blurry? It does, doesn't it? I was thinking the same thing. It doesn't through our camera. Huh. Must be our feed. Mm. Must be the feed. Hmm. Uh, we're giving away a silver ring tonight. 
I don't know if you saw that, but I have a silver heart ring I'm giving away. So you're not going to want to go anywhere. It's super beautiful. Later on tonight, a sterling silver ring. If you want to win that, I'm going to give that away um, right in the middle of doing our auction for jewelry. Take a look at that. Tanya says it looks fine there. Okay, Isn't maybe that it's just our feed then. Giving that away later. Silver. Nice. Yeah. Nancy, congrats. Yeah, congratulations. I love that one. All right. Okay, and next up, I have Mickey. He's a classic. I got two Mickeys. I'm going to go with the baby blue because he's so cute. This is from the Disneyland Resort. All right. This is from the actual Disneyland. These are the ones they have. They sell there. Beautiful baby blue and blue. And it says Disneyland Resort, no work, all play. Love that. Super cool. Has the retro Double sleeve. XL on that. Double XL. All work, no pay, play. I mean, all play, no work. It's the wrong term for you. Yeah, it's the giveaway, the silver ring with the heart. Yeah. Uh, what size is it? Let me check. It's a little over six. So. All right. Sadie and Ollie, congrats. Yeah, silver ring for the giveaway. Super fun. All right, next up, Double X Incredibles. I love this one. Great collar on it. Again, from the Disney store. Super cute. Has the retro sleeves, the great vibrant red and yellow and blue. Love it. Double X Incredibles. Disney shirt. All right. Just have a couple more shirts and then we're going to move on to something else. Okay. And I also have the Family Guy shirt. Do you guys want me to do that one? It looks new. Super. Is anyone into the Family Guy? Let me know. We'll just run it. Or not. Captain Loudpants, congrats. Oh my gosh, that's a funny name. Captain Loudpants, I love it. Okay, this next one, it's Anderson Apparel. And this one's super cute. It says... Uh, I don't see the size on this one. I think it's a double X though. And it says, oh boy, with Mickey on it. Oh boy. Mickey, oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah. That's funny. Mm -hmm. You got that down really good, honey. Mm. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. And then I have a classic. But the oh boy one, oh, well, one likes your oh boy. Um <clears throat> We have the pajama bottoms if you guys still want those. Oh, here's another family guy. Do you guys want the family guy one? That is. Oh, that's the same one. I thought there was two. Lorema, congrats. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, classic, classic Mickey Double X Disney. Love the gray with the classic Disney on it. Yeah, Cute classic. retro sleeves. We're going. One more shirt after this, and then we're done. The rest will just stay. <laughs> I'm trying to pick up the best ones. Family Guy, I'm going to run it anyways. For all you that want it. Single stitch? No. Uh, I don't think so. No double. But most of everything we got out there was like early 2000s. This one, this one's 2007. The Family Guy one. Okay. <clears throat> all right. All right, this one's 2007, so. Hunting Lost Treasures, congrats. And this is the only difference between me and you is that I'm a genius who will someday rule the world and you're just an idiot. Wow, that's interesting. Uplifting. <laughs> Very uplifting. Double X. And we're going with the family guy. And it looks in great condition. 2007. PGA Pants, are they men's or women's? Great question, Mom G. I'll look. Um... They're in really nice shape, and they're from the Disney Park, so they're more expensive. It says, I know, medium, size medium. It doesn't say men or women. It's, that's my saying. All right, Lorena, congrats These are again. really nice. I'll run these. Oh, they still have the little tag on them, guys. I don't think these ones have been worn. Hmm. These are medium. Drawstring, vintage Mickey, and many. So medium. 
Okay, US medium. And they have an elastic waist, so there's some give or take, but these are nice. These are from the Disney Resort. So really cute with all the classics on there, kind of a retro. These are pajama pant. We're gonna run them. You guys asked for them, so hey. Why not, why not? Let me see if I have any more. This is all Disney Resort stuff, which that can be. This is just, oh, these are pajamas. I have a matching set of PJs from the Disney store. <clears throat> and they're extra large, so we can run those too if you want. The next set is an extra large set of PJs, and it's a top and a bottom. So those are from the Disney Resort. They have the Disney Resort tag in them, these ones do. And they still have a tag on them like they haven't been worn. So it's a good deal, eight bucks. All right, and McCountry's, congrats. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. That was a good deal. Okay, so these are extra large Disney PJs from the Disney store. Your classic button-down long-sleeve PJ. This is an extra large, okay? And I could be unisex. I don't know. I mean, it could be guy or girl. And it comes with the elastic waist pajamas. These are definitely not new. So they look in good condition, but there's some wear on it. You could tell. So I'm going to – is that the right weight, or should I do a pound? Uh, I could do a pound. Yeah, let's just do Two pound. pieces, so yeah. it's a little bit heavier. Okay, right. okay. Full it's set. Running. Full set there. Disney full set. Oh my gosh, this is a Winnie the Pooh sleeper. Yeah, these are long shirts. Oh my, it's a pajama. Yeah, it's yeah. Like, like it's night shirts. Sleeper. Yeah, they talked about it's in the night. video. This is so cute. <clears throat> An embroidered Winnie the Pooh school. Yeah. Kevin, deals. four bucks. Kevin, good, oh good deal. Oh my goodness! All right, next up, we're gonna do the blanket. We're gonna do the blanket. It's a brand new park throw with Mickey, and then it has all the different exciting pieces. Um, and this is really inch nice. Forty inch by sixty inch. Forty inch by sixty inch fleece blanket, right from Disney. All right, guys, let's do it. And there is the pattern on it. All right, we're running, guys. Disney Fleece, brand new blanket, 40 by 60. Brand new. All right, we also have the Disney Mouse pad set. Oh, we also have this blanket, too. Brand new baby. One. I'm going to. Thanks, Julie. I hope everyone watches it, too. <laughs> This blanket's brand new, but I'm taking it out of the bag so you can see it better. Yeah, it's so pretty. Disney baby. All right, it could be sold. Sherry, congrats. All right, this one's super beautiful. Brand new in the bags. This has not been used. Winnie the Pooh embroidered. Look at this, guys. For a baby. It's this beautiful fleece with the brown satin. Disney baby. Again, brand new. Cozy comfort. I don't see a size on it. You know, it might be. On it? No. Oh, it's a flower. Embroidered flower. Nice. Let me see if I can get the width on it, the size. I don't see the size, but it's a baby blanket. Brand new. So cute. Beautiful condition. Brand new. All right. Uh, wait, wait, wait. What's the weight on that? 12 to 15 is good. Okay. All right. Brand new baby blanket. Winnie the Pooh. Everybody loves Pooh. Disney, Winnie the Pooh. We're know. running it. It's running. Super cute. Oh, I know. It's so soft, guys. Such beautiful. So soft. Look at that with the embroidery. That's so cute. This is nice, guys. P for Pooh. P for Pooh. All right. We also have some Beanie Babies left in the five pound box. If you guys want the bears, I have a whole entire box of Beanie Baby bears. I can do one box and see how it goes. Why not do one? See how it goes. There's That's five one. pound too? Yep. 
All right. DJ Theo, congrats. Ten bucks. Good deal. All right. This is five pound two. We're going to do the books first, and then we'll do the Beanie Babies. All right, guys. These are really classic. Okay. We have a lot of books. Up. Toy Story. Toy Story 2. Dalmatian 2. Dalmatian 1. Lion King. These are in great shape. Jungle Book. Baby and the Tramp. Finding Nemo, Cinderella, Cars. I mean, gosh, guys, this is a great collection for someone. Boom. Look at this. Aristocats, Allison in Wonderland, all the classics. Literally all of them. You can go ahead and start it. Well, let's get a kill. Okay. Monsters Inc. 20, I think there's 21. 21, guys. There's at least 21 books here. Right. All Disney classics. Beautiful all, condition. All one money starts at a book. One dollar start here at Locker Nuts, guys. Let's go. All these beautiful Disney classics right here. This is great, guys. Look at the condition on these. These are beautiful. Kids need to be reading. And there's like a little game in the back. That's so cool. 21 books. All right. 21 books of Disney, guys. We're going to be giving away, I know, right? We're going to be giving away a silver ring in a little bit. So, super nice, beautiful heart silver ring. Excited about that. All right, these are going for a steal. It's a buck a buck. Woo! All right, congrats. 23 bucks. Congrats. Nice. Enjoy those. Those are cool. <clears throat> really great deal on that. All right, we got lots of silver coming up still. Super excited about our jewelry coming up next. I'm going to do one box of Beanie Babies here. <clears throat> I got two Valentinas, and I do know I did look these up. Some of like the St. Patrick one, and some of them do still have some value. But these are brand new, original buyer. Some of these could be air tags. But they're, I mean, even if you're just to buy them for a retail value of just the value of brand new bears, the prayer bears, we have five, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Oh my gosh, this one's so cute. I love Hawaii in the original bag. 19 of them, guys. 19 of them. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and run it. Don't break my achy, breaky heart on these. 19 of them. Beautiful, perfect condition, guys. And we got peace there right here. We got the angel there. We got the brain there. We got the St. Patrick one, which is one of my absolute faves. We got these little Christmas bears and some other bears. Love Amazing this. Works. Congrats. All right. Sold for 23. I have a couple more boxes. Should I get them or not? Nope. Okay. Okay. It's fine. I'm just asking. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, okay. okay. Set of like smokes next. No one's asked for that. Yeah. Oh. Let's do jewelry. People have asked for jewelry. Okay. Let's give them, let's give the people what they want. Oh, I also have this bag of let's do this because it's five pounds uh, or a letter this is all jewelry making items brand new chains none of it is silver crystals pearls stones all sorts of beads glass pendants a uh, totally big bag of that's uh are, are you doing this with it no they're separate <clears throat> all right this is all Jewelry making items. Neck, sure. Necklaces. Um, this came from the estate by you guys. Remember when I had before? So these are like different stones, and there's like a whole bunch in here, guys. Some chains, some crystal earrings. Oh, amazing works. That was the first buy. That's oh. awesome. Congrats to you. Thank you. Kathy's in the house. What's up, Kathy? Thanks for being here. Quartz. I don't know what that is. But really nice stones in here, guys. Um, chains. Oh, hunting lost treasures for sure. We could do that. What? 
wants us to write S.J. Latoury oh, on okay. these books. Sure. And then we sold some of these before. These are these glass pendants. Look at these. They're beautiful. And you're giving like all these beautiful pieces. All right. Tons of jewelry making stuff in here, guys. Stones. More. And this came from, remember that estate I had all that jewelry? This was what was left of some of that. You can go ahead and run it. All right. It's running. Starts at the buck. All the jewelry making stuff. Yeah, all the jewelry making stuff. Some earrings, brand new. Brand new items, all this. Some pretty little jewels here. Those are nice. Crystals, more crystals. More crystals here. And then some other pieces. Hey, Barb, thanks for being here. Here. I don't know what that is. Some sort of metal. And then <clears throat> heart veils. It's alone seven bucks just for this little stuff. I know, right? Seven dollars for that little thing. Look at this, guys. This is good stuff. Um, these pretty little necklaces. These have a nice little clasp on them. Uh, more crystals here. These necklaces are really nice, though. They're swarf skin? Yeah, there is oh. a little bit. Look at how pretty these little bracelets are. There's a whole bunch of them brand new in there. Whole bag of like four or five of these. They're super cute. So, all right. Loretta, congrats. Yeah, congrats. That was a good deal for that. Certified sold. All right. Now, this just came out of Jack's recent locker. People were asking for it. So, we're going to give it to you. We know threads mm -hmm. can get pretty expensive. So, we have some really beautiful beads. And then we also have, and these are older, so it's kind of cool. Can't really see the beauty from the, how yeah, old. She says, the, holy cow, what is the deal? Yeah, that one really was. So beautiful. Look at these guys. I didn't test any of these stones. This all came out of Jack's locker. <clears throat> Good stuff here. This is older too. So, and then all of these, all those threads, and then there's some patterns. So, like, these are the patterns. <clears throat> so, some older patterns. Yeah, those are the only patterns I've found in there. So, it's basically all the sewing, <coughs> all the sewing stuff uh, that I found in there. I'm starting it. Starts at a butt. And it's kind of a good time to test this because the locker I went through today has a ton of sewing stuff. Like, I mean, basically the whole locker was sewing stuff. Yeah, this is I old have a lot thread. of old patterns. I have a lot of thread. I have a lot of stuff coming out. But if we only get a dollar, then we probably won't sell it. <laughs> Mike's in here. Mike's here. What's up, Mike? Pirate in the house, guys. And as I said earlier, next week we won't be on Monday. We'll be on Friday. We're doing a competition. Pirates uh, organizing it. So that's gonna be a fun day. And look for more details to come about that. We're on, I think, at 3 p.m. That's Friday the 5th, April 5th. Ooh, these blue are great. All right, so for eight bucks, Cindy, congrats. <coughs> that was a great deal. All right, guys, now we're going into the silver. We'll be giving away a um, silver ring in the middle of the jewelry, so be ready for the giveaway on the silver ring. I'm super excited about that. Maybe we just turn the light down. All right, I have silver pendants. I have so many great silver necklaces and earrings i have a lot of great silver this is amazing guys this is a silver coin i think it's a french coin take a look at that i'll be auctioning that off as well really really cool they punched a hole in it to make it a pendant so all right let me grab some of my tools here we have some watches i have a brighton watch i have an opal necklace <clears throat> i have what do you guys want to start with? I have necklaces, rings. Okay, let's do a giveaway while she's setting up here. We're going to give away this little silver mm -hmm. ring right here. Hearts. And it says love inside. Is that what this is? And what size was this? A little over six. Six. That was... Okay. Huh? Nothing. I just said I was waiting to do that. I just said that. But that's okay. Well, the time is now. All right. Let's do... Uh, that is a giveaway, guys. So make sure you enter that giveaway. Sterling silver ring. 
All right. Well, we'll be doing the poo nightgown. Is that what you had there? Was a poo nightgown? Earlier, yeah. Possibly. <clears throat> the pajamas were going kind of low, so we want to give you guys what you want. There wouldn't seem to be too much interest for that stuff. All right. Make sure you enter that giveaway. If you guys don't know where the giveaway is, it is over here. Whoops, over here. There's a giveaway button. Click that and it'll pull out and you can enter it right there. Above my head. Okay. All right, like Jack said, this is a sterling silver ring, size six. We're doing that giveaway. So make sure you enter in to win it. How fun. Okay, awesome. All right, <clears throat> we have necklaces, rings, we have pendants. Did Oops. anyone see what they Not got? Not showing up. Okay, hang on. Maybe I didn't start it right. <clears throat> Should be running. <clears throat> yeah, it says it's running. Fifty-three people in. All right. All right, awesome. they see it. All right. Uh, we do ship to Canada. Yeah, we just don't do that for the giveaways. We don't do international shipping for the giveaways, but the per when you purchase something, you can have it shipped to Canada. And it will tell you how much that costs for international shipping. All right, guys, we got this first ring. It's beautiful. It's a six and three fourths sterling silver ring. I cannot test the stones because they are too small. So very, very pretty, though. I think this one's Vermeil, actually. Hold on. Yeah, this is the gold silver with the gold overlay. It's 925 marked inside. So <clears throat> this is the Vermeil, the gold overlay. Super beautiful ring. Isn't that pretty? Six and three fourths. We'll go ahead and start it. Okay. Super little pretty ring. I love this one. Really, really nice. Six and three fourths on this one. Yeah, isn't it pretty? I love it. Okay, 20 seconds. It's got a lot of nice silver on it. Beautiful ring. Thank you guys for being here and thanks for your bids. Appreciate y'all. That's some really cool pendants. I have some great silver necklaces with a ton of silver, guys. So if you're looking for silver chains, let me know and I can show you what I have. I have some really beautiful ones. This one's gorgeous. Thank you for your bids. So tomorrow morning we got another YouTube video dropping. It's already done. I just have to finish watching it. I was out all day. So I'll finish watching it tonight and set it to release tomorrow morning. So if you guys like watching those videos, it's a new locker tomorrow. So it's going to be exciting. Still not done with the Disney locker. The di lag called it the land of the diapers. Mm -hmm. Not finished with that one. We took a break because another yeah. option came up and uh, got a nice couple small units. They're, they're very exciting. Nancy, so, congrats, Nancy. Yeah. Congratulations, Nancy. All right. Last week, I had some people ask for Tiger's Eye. So this one is an eight, size eight ring, Tiger's Eye. Look how pretty that is. What a cool design, right? The light is just washing it out. Nope. So we're doing at the minimum. Size eight. <clears throat> size eight. Right here. Who are the diapers? Oh. Super pretty. From the market, they just did not sell very well in Stockton. Nothing sells that well in Stockton unless you give them away. All right, Tiger's Eye, guys. Really pretty, modern-looking, size 8 ring. I love this. You guys asked for it, so we brought it to you. It's the only Tiger's Eye I want to have. Okay, guys, you have one minute left to enter in for the Silver Heart Ring. Enter in for the Silver Heart Ring. Oh, someone in YouTube's asking about the diapers? Yeah. Uh, yeah, funny. they are all gone. They all went to uh, Stockton over two separate trips. In This one's a gorgeous, guys. Bye-bye. Thank 25 so cents. I mean, well, seriously, like we didn't sell very many diapers, unfortunately. All right. Thank you guys for your bids. Sold. Loretta, congrats. Beautiful. All right. The next one I have is a sterling silver um, <clears throat> pendant. Look at that. It has some real weight to it with this beautiful hefty bell. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous piece of silver. I love this seashell. So, so pretty. Let's just get the weight on it. It's 10.1 grams of silver, guys. 10.1 grams of silver. Let me get you the length on it. It is 
right here. Just about two inches, maybe a little longer. Super beautiful. Oh, we got a winner. Celeste. Celeste, you won, you won the ring, the sterling silver heart ring. Congrats. Nice. Congrats to Congratulations. you. Congratulations. All right, over 10 grams of silver on this beautiful, beautiful pendant, guys. This is gorgeous. It's vintage. We're going to go ahead and run it. All right. Beautiful. Yeah. Lisa's asking, was it baby or adult diapers? So in the beginning, it was baby diapers. And then we got in the back, a little bit of spoiler, it was adult diapers. So is... They but, like them diapers. Baby diapers would sell better than adult diapers. But on, I mean, adult diapers should sell. They're expensive and people need them. But uh, we just didn't have the buyers for it in Stockton. And no resellers were willing to step up and take a deal. So it's a little disappointing. There's a lot of diapers. You'll mm -hmm. see at least a hundred cases of them. No kidding. All right. Yeah. Congratulations. Oh yeah. I know Cindy says I saw on eBay diapers were being sold for a lot for vintage diapers. We didn't have the vintage ones. I saw that too, Cindy. Okay guys, this is a, a nine grams, nine grams. This is a really beautiful etched silver cat. Look at that. So cute. It's the backside with a, like a little collar. It has this abstract look to it. This is very, very beautiful. Sterling silver over nine grams on this pendant. Really, really cat, cute. Huh? If you love cats, this one is so, so cute. It has the little tail and the bow. And I love, yeah, really cute. The little stones on it. This one's got a lot of really nice detail to it. And a good amount of silver. So very nice, super pretty. I love this one, really, really nice. All right. Sold $25, you know, all right guys. Debbie, yeah, congrats. This one is, you guys better get your bidding sticks out on this. This is a beautiful silver necklace, guys. We're sitting at 39 grams of silver. Look at this. Beautiful. Many of these are Italian. Look at that. Gorgeous. Look at the length on this. Almost 40 grams of silver, guys. I'm going to give you the length on it. It is in beautiful, beautiful condition. So pretty, okay? Length on that one is 16 inches. Stunning. Oh, that's so nice, Debbie. That's awesome. All right, guys. I don't know what the name of this one is, but it's almost 40 grams. And look at the work on that. Really beautiful, right? See, there's a mark on there too. Let me try to see if I can like that, right? A little way and then do that. Can you read that? It's got a maker mark right there. So you guys can see that. So. Happy Jack, what's up? Thanks for being here, Jack. Really, really nice. It does have a maker mark on it. Super beautiful. All right, guys, I'm gonna run it. This is a dollar start, guys, for 40 grams of silver. Do not mess around on this. Do not delay. It is beautiful. The work on this is so stunning. So, so beautiful, guys. Oh, my gosh. Come on, guys. 40 grams of silver here, guys. 40 grams. Let's go. It's not just any silver. It's got a maker mark. It's beautiful. This is a very high-end piece, guys. Beautiful, beautiful. It sold 50 bucks. That was a skill. Loretta, a skill. All right, this one's super cool. I love it. Reminds me of like the military um, dog tag style of chain. Great clasp on this. It has some nice length to it. It's very, very pretty. I think it's 18 inches, but I'm gonna just verify it with you real quick. <clears throat> I have more rings too, guys. I'm gonna just hop in between. Oh, wow. This one is uh, 21 inches. So definitely got some length on it, 21 inches. This one also has a little maker mark on it. Super small. See it right there? A lot of these were Italy. Very, very nice. 
gorgeous necklace really really pretty kind of a cut to, to the silver so it has that real nice sparkle to it really beautiful 21 inches guys 21 inches this one's very very pretty it's like dots and dashes yeah it kind of is that's a good but it has like a see how it has a real shimmer to it the way it's cut it's very pretty 21 inches. Can you give me the necklace on the display so I can do that one next, please? It's right behind you. Um, that's, I'm sure it would. Jack already packed it away. I thought the bell on that was pretty large. 23 sold. Congrats, Debbie. All right, this next one's really pretty. It's got this really great looking opal in it. Look at that. So, so pretty. And I'm going to measure it. And the actual chain is made up of little hearts. <clears throat> How cute is this, right? 18 mm. inches. Super pretty. And I love this piece. Really delicate. Again, look at that. Like little hearts, the whole chain. How cool is that? I've never seen that before. 18 inches with an opal. Look at that. And, and the whole chain is hearts. Darling. Darling piece. Super cool. I know the heart chain is unbelievably sweet, right? I'm just loving it. I have a men, a couple men's rings too. So if you guys want those, let me know. I have some, I have some really pretty vintage ones. All right, guys, this has got an opal in it. So, all right, congratulations, August. August, right? congrats. That one's so pretty. Okay. <clears throat> This ring's really pretty. It has like the gold tone and some other tones to it. And it kind of looks like that Black Hills look, you know? Let's see how that is. Mary says, my daughter loves silver. <clears throat> oh, good, because we have some really beautiful pieces tonight. This is uh, just under eight, just under a size eight. See how that is? Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. So it's like silver and gold tone for me. This one's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, I'm running this just about a size eight. Very, very pretty. Look at it go. I hit start three times. <clears throat> I wasn't starting. All right, guys, beautiful ring. Look at that. I did not test the stones on that because they're kind of small, but they're really pretty. This one's older. It's really, really nice. Look at that. That was just like a daffodil. Gorgeous ring. So zoom in. Make the ring bigger so you don't get so close. Like that? Yeah. And pull it a little closer. Okay. No, your hand. Pull your oh. hand closer. Yeah, so you can see it much better. Okay. Crystal, congratulations. Crystal, congrats. All right. <clears throat> this is a beautiful pendant right here. Look at the back. 925 with a, some, I think it's a Brighton piece. It's a 925 Brighton piece. Uh, did not test the stones on it. Very, very pretty. Black stone in the middle. Brighton piece. Really gorgeous, right? 925. Sterling silver. Brighton piece. Very beautiful. Does the pendant open? I don't think so. It doesn't appear to be. <clears throat> I mean, it could, but I didn't. Maybe it does. Oh, maybe it does, Mom G. You're right. Oh, nice call, Mom G. Hmm. Yeah, cool. I don't know if you could change the stone, but very cool. Yeah, it has a hinge on it. Super neat. <clears throat> this one's cool. Brighton's nice. Um, I have a Brighton watch too. Why don't you can you give me some watches while I'll do this? <coughs> I have a couple citizen watches too. Um, Jack, would you mind looking up the numbers? Because I want to post them before we list them so people can look them. Because they're kind of valuable. Um, if you want to. <clears throat> All right, this kind of looks like Heminite. The Hemonite stone on it. Does that sound right, guys? I think so. Uh, 925, it's a cross. Let me get the length on it, and I'll get the weight on it. It's super pretty. <clears throat> it's length on this is two inches. Hematite. Hematite, yeah, that's what I thought. Hematite, I'm getting to know my stuff. Um, sterling silver, beautiful two-inch cross. Really, really nice. I have a couple citizen watches that are really nice. 
So I'll be showing those up next. And I have some really cool um, silver work that's really vintage and neat. All right, beautiful. Two inch Shemonite cross with a beautiful sterling. This one's gorgeous. <laughs> Hi, Eddie. Yeah, I know, right, Mama G? Hello, Eddie. How goes it? All right, sold. Kathy, congratulations. That was a beautiful one. All right, I'm a sucker for hearts, so I just love any hearts. I love etching. I love the artwork on this. This is so pretty. Um, <coughs> There's a lot me. of numbers on here. I'm not sure what you want to write down. 5.2, the model number. 5.2 grams, and this is a sterling silver heart. Really, really pretty. Love this one. Beautiful, right? Is this not beautiful? Sterling silver etched. Totally nice. I love this, guys. It's so romantic. So beautiful. I'm a sucker for jewelry. Very, very cool. Oh, good, Kathy. I have one more cross, too. Oh, it is Holy Week, so... It's a great, I actually have two crosses. Oh my gosh, I have a really cool cross with a necklace. It's kind of valuable. I'll, I'll do that one next. And we are sold. Thank you so much. Amazing works, congrats. <clears throat> All right, this one is got a name on it. It's like Mila or something, Mara. Okay. The necklace is this, and do you see this? It looks like turquoise and black onyx and like carnelian or something in there. It's a sterling silver necklace and vermeil, so it's like the gold and silver. Here's the clasp. Unbelievably beautiful. I'm going to measure it all for you. The cross has got some really nice size to it. This one's very unique. Um, okay, the cross is <clears throat> two and a half inches. And the necklace has some really nice length to it. And it's very, very beautiful. Um, the necklace itself is um, 20, <clears throat> 23 inches. So 23 inches. Look at this. I just want you to get a really close look at this. It does have a name on the back right there. So I don't know if that's the brand or the designer, <clears throat> but a beautiful piece. Okay, it looks like more letters than that, like four letters, but 22, almost 23 inches. Look at that. Wow, guys. Right? Should I do four to um, seven on this one, honey? Or is three to one to three? Okay. <coughs> on this necklace? Just do this for. Okay. All right, guys, here we go. This one is a one of a kind, probably the most unique, beautiful one I've ever seen. And you guys, it's not just um, the pendant, it's the necklace and the pendant. So you're getting some real value in this, guys. Look at that. And this is sterling, guys. All right, All right 25 bucks. Oh my gosh, that was a deal on that one. All right. I do. All right. So here we go, we have this beautiful watch. And I know these ones have some really nice value to it. Look at this beautiful condition, guys. Um, super, super nice. Look at that. Okay. Um, and shipping showing 31 cents. I don't know what that's about. Hmm? It's 8023 on this one, okay? Eight zero two three. If you want to look at this, this is a citizen watch. Beautiful. Okay. What about the shipping rummage? It was showing it was 31 cents. I don't know what that means. Fixture shipping, it's showing 31 cents. I don't know. Huh? So maybe you get on another phone. And see what they're what? saying that the shipping show is showing. I don't, I don't, we don't see it on our end. I'm oh, okay. get on another phone. My phones are all logged in the same account. So, all right, Citizen oh. Watch 8023, <clears throat> eight, guys. Look it up. Beautiful condition. 
really, really gorgeous. Okay, guys? This has got some money. Check it out. Yeah, that's probably because you bought some stuff already. That's right. All right, guys, Citizen Watch. Don't mess on this one. It is gorgeous. Look up the value on it. It has some good, good value. It is in really nice. Oh, yeah, one to three ounces. Fine. It might be a little bit more, but it, it, won't, it won't matter. If it goes over, I'll just pay the, the overage. That's okay. All right, guys, Citizens Watch 8023. I think this is a very expensive watch. So, all right. I have a couple more. 8023 on this Citizen Watch, guys. Let's go. Storage gems. I think you got yourself a gem there. Congrats. All right. This is a Brighton Santa Barbara watch. Beautiful work. The band definitely has some really pretty, uh, like, it's all leather with the metal on it. Um, very, very pretty. So this is a Brighton. Gorgeous work on this watch. And it's called the Santa Barbara. All right. It's Brennan. Who doesn't love me some Brighton? Brighton is pretty. Look at that. Beautiful Brighton watch. This one's really nice. Has a lot of really pretty work to it. No problem, Kathy. Don't worry about it. All right, you guys want more rings or necklaces, bracelets? Let me know. Great deal on the Brighton watch. <clears throat> All right. Rings. Okay. 21 sold. All right. Doors. Congrats. Before I get to the rings, I'm going to do one more pendant. So this is a, I believe, a French coin. I looked it up. The coin itself is quite valuable. You guys can look it up. <clears throat> I know you did miss it, but I have one more plus. Okay, silver coin. 29.2 grams. 29.2 grams of silver. Take your little shot of it. Yeah, I do have another glass. I have one more cross pen that I can do before I switch back to the rings. Okay. Yes, yeah, so it looks like it's been drilled out for a pendant or something. Okay, 29.2 grams of silver on this, guys. I believe it is a French coin. Very cool. Almost 30 grams of solid silver, and it's cool. And very pretty on a necklace, guys. All right. Come on, guys. This is almost 40 grams of silver. Let's go. Okay, oh, I joined band camp, huh? Oh, my gosh. Sorry, Kathy. Not here. <laughs> You're not banned in. All right, sold. No, my country is a nice pickup. Yeah, nice. All right, I'm going to do one more cross because you asked. Uh, this one's really pretty. Here's the back. Here is the front. It has like hammered silver. And then in the center, I can't tell if it's like a coin or what. Kind of looks like a coin, right? I don't know. See? Yeah, it does look like a coin. It's like a, it looks like an ancient coin of some sort they hammered into the silver. Oh, I don't know if they hammered it. It's got prongs on the back. I think you can pull the coin out if you want. Yeah, I'll change the coin up. Beautiful hammered work, though, all in the cross right here. It's so pretty how oh, that's all really neat. It is lovely, right? It's very lovely. All right, guys, it's all sterling silver. And you can see the coin that's in there. Kind of cool. Ancient looking coin. All right, sterling silver. A 
All right, let's go, let's go. Sold 13. 13, go. good deal, Kathleen. Congrats. All right, we want to do some rings. We'll do some rings. All right, this next ring is a size nine and three fourths. Nine and three fourths. It's sterling silver. Really pretty setting on it. Look at that. Super pretty. Nine and three fourths. What a sparkler. Very, very pretty. Nine and three fourths. It's a one in. Hey, Ed, what's up? Hey, Ed, how's it going? I'm not sure. I mean, I know it's not like it's either CZ or it is silver. Yeah, I'd, but nothing precious. Yeah, it's so pretty, right? Super pretty. I love it. The setting itself is so gorgeous. Like a little tiny stones all together. Very, very pretty. Bit of it, pretty. Sold. Nancy, congrats. Congratulations. All right, this one is older and it's really, really neat. It is, I'm not sure what it is. Can you tell? Uh -uh. It's super vintage, right? So, you guys have to tell me because I'm not sure. Let me get the size for you. It is a five. Size five. Mother Mary. I don't know, guys. It's really cool work on it, though. It's really neat. Mother and baby. Okay. Size five. It's neat. And it's silver. Look at the little styling of it. I think it's cool. It's wow. definitely an older piece. A lot of silver work to it. It is not like easy to do. <laughs> All right, sold. Congratulations. Congrats, Lizzie. Nice pickup. All right, got another beauty. This one's got a ton of silver to it. Look at that. Super pretty. Let me get a size on it. Seven and a half. Seven and a half. Look at that stunner. Stunner runner. Tons of silver. Seven and a half. We're running it. Look at all that silver, guys. This is a vintage, kind of a modern looking piece. I love it. Seven and a half. Let's go. Beautiful silver on that one. I love the work on it. Very, very pretty. I got some larger rings too. And we're sold. Congrats. Amazing works. Congrats again. Yeah, amazing. Amazing works is amazingly happy. All right. <clears throat> I have this beauty. This one's super cool. I love it. Let me get the size for you. <clears throat> it kind of lands about eight and a half, happily. But it probably has some give to it the way the setting it is. I do. I need a cough drop, and I'm going to go get one right after this. <clears throat> Unless Jack wants to give me one. Where are they at? Uh, they're in our bathroom, but I'll get it. It's okay. All right. Super pretty. I'll let Jack do a couple of necklaces after. <clears throat> if you want to run any of these necklaces, and I'll just go run and grab them. Really quick. Thanks, guys. <laughs> this one's beautiful, guys. It has some really nice silver work to it. Jack's going to run some really pretty necklaces. You can put them up on here. I have this really pretty cross one. Oh, I do have one more cross. Oh, gosh. Telling lies. Jeez. Here you go. All right, 17 sold on that one. That was a good deal. Miranda, congrats. All right, I'll be right back in a flash. Thanks, guys. All right. 
Okay, next up, we got a necklace with a little cross. Ah, looks like we got some opals in there. That's cool. Got some opals, probably some CZs. That's my guess. 925 sterling silver. I do apologize for my hands, guys. I've been digging in some dirty lockers. Today was a locker with probably over 10 years of dust, at least 10 years of dust. There's our, uh, what do you call it? Whatever. Um, okay. Ooh. Length. 7.5, so it's a 15 inch chain, 15 inch or so. White gloves. <laughs> nah, that's, I'm not fancy enough for that. Okay, let's start it. Today I did wear gloves. I don't usually like wearing gloves in the unit. It's just hard to. Uh, it's hard to connect with stuff when you have gloves on, but today I had to because it was so dirty. So dirty. <laughs> yeah. It's, the, last week I was going through a 10 by 25, a 10 by 25, and that one beat me up. I got scratches and everything everywhere. That was a tough locker, a lot of heavy stuff. Julie won that one. Congrats, Julie. That was really pretty. Such a nice piece. Okay, the one today was easy. It was small, four by five, but it's just so literally there's like three inches of dust on the floor. And when I was done, I was sweeping it up. It was like my dustpan was heavy. That's so crazy. Okay, let's see. Let me grab something else here. Ooh, look at this whale tail. That's kind of cool. It's a little rope chain. Silver. There's our 925. Wait, is that 925? Yeah, 925 right there. That's a heavy one. It is. Right? Did you weigh it? No. You wanna? Let's see how much silver. 19.3 grams. Ooh. Okay, That's and then I'll get a length. You take the yeah. Okay. 24 inch chain. 24. All right, we're going to run it. Um, There was some competition. Yeah, this is not an area that I normally go to. It's an hour and 15 from my, from my house. And uh, a lot of those guys know me out there. They're very um, nice. But I don't get any favors. <laughs> <laughs> one guy, one guy, I think he's just got a bug up his butt about me. He's just, it's not, it's not only that he bids against me all the time, he also just has such a puss on his face when he does it. I'm like, okay. Some guys just don't like the YouTubers. That's fine. I don't care. I might pay a little bit more because of that, but I still get what I want. I'm not going to give up just because. I'm getting some stink out from a couple guys. But there's, it's funny, I haven't been out that part of the, the area in a while. And uh, it was in Turlock today. And, uh, but when I got there, I, Keith, congrats. I see guys that I've, I've, uh, I've known before and they're like, hey, I haven't seen you for a while. So there's like, guys that are totally cool too. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's nice. And then you hear some stories. Oh, this guy got a Star Wars locker. And, you know, they, they talk, talk about some of the recent wins. And it sure seems like lately there's been some guys winning pretty big. You want to do the labeling stuff since I'm doing this? Because then we can move a little faster. Okay, next one. Like a little ball. Looks like a teardrop. Silver. And here's the clasp. Ready? Nope. Uh oh, okay. Length. I think that one's 18. Just about right. Close enough. 18 inch. Beautiful pendant on that one. All right, we're running it. Put 
We're running it, running it, running it. Yeah, necklaces are also silver. So I just saw that question. All, all that we're running is 925 here. Yeah. And we just have one gold plated piece. Let me get the brand on that one. I have a picture of it. Camille, welcome. She says, sorry, I'm late. It's not late. You're right on time. You're just in time. Okay, Nancy won that one. Congrats, Nancy. Congratulations, Nancy. 17. That was a great deal on that day. Dang, girl. I think this is a men's Ooh, ring. Dang, 13, almost 13. Just shy of 13. Yeah, I think it's a men's ring. Yeah. But hey, we just can work too if you want. No problem. What kind of stone is that? Is it a CZ, most likely? It's not a diamond. Yeah. Not a diamond. Not a diamond. That's. This is Jade uh, though. But it is 925 silver. Yeah. That's pretty that's pretty sweet looking. Mm -hmm. Let me show you guys up close. Here we go. That one's pretty. I got check it out. Looks nice. Yeah, it's a lot of silver too. Dang my fingers are wrecked. <laughs> I've been working in the locker oh, so many days. That's awesome. So almost size 13 here, guys. Silver. It's running. Yeah, we have a couple men's rings. Or women's, whoever wants to wear it. You can do what you want on that. Yep, no judgment. I wear women's rings, I don't care. Chance got nothing to say. This one's really pretty too, if you want to do that one. Hunting Lost Treasures wants to know, how do you tell the difference between silver-plated dishes and pure silver? Uh -huh. I think it's extremely difficult. It is. If it's Mark Sterling, that's really yeah, the only way. Yes. Sometimes there's some markings on the bottom you can uh, Google. I've heard people say, like, you take a magnet to it, but most of the silver plated I've found does not stick to a magnet. So, congratulations. DJ Mix Factory, that was a nice ring for 22 bucks. Oh Sweet. Oh, gosh. Heck yeah. That's another men's ring right here. Oh, that one's off the hook. I mean, oh, off the yeah, off the scale. Really nice. Little over thirteen. I say it's like a thirteen and a quarter, probably. Let's see. Silver. We're running it. <clears throat> really pretty pattern on it too, though. I love the patterns. Over thirteen. There's our ninety-five mark inside. Over thirteen. It's probably thirteen and a quarter to thirteen and a half. The little rope design is very pretty, guys. Come on, guys. Everyone's always asking us, oh, well, I want men's rings. Let's go. <coughs> I have a jade necklace with jade earrings. Tested jade. Jadeite jade. Come on, guys. Silver ring. Men's silver ring. Over 13. Beautiful. I'm trying, Jack. All right. Happy Jack won it. Congrats. Jack, congrats. Okay, next up. Congratulations, Jack. That one's kind of cool, huh? That's like an eight and a quarter. You know, what are these? They look like runes. It's cool, right huh? Here. I think that's what that's called, runes. That one's got, it looks like a little, like, it's, it's got some silver. Oh, does it have a marker? Oh, look at that. It has a mark, a maker mark in the inside. Show that. Uh -huh. A little pyramid. A triangle within a triangle. All right, there's a maker's mark on this one, guys. So pay attention to it. Maybe it's native. I don't know. That one's cool. Can you hit run. Since yeah, sure. It's pretty cool. It's just a little different. It's super cool. Yeah, it does look like that. That's so true. All right, guys, it's got a lot of silver on it, and it has a maker's mark on it. So pay attention to the maker's mark. Hi, Griff. Oh, maybe. Stargate. <laughs> you guys are funny. Maybe. Lots of silver on this one, okay? Don't miss it. Someone's getting a deal. Come on, guys. This has got to go at least 30 bucks. This one's got It's very nice. Oh, Greek, maybe, huh? Yeah, maybe. Huh? 
Yeah. Wish I was smarter. I know. You're pretty smart. Compared to like a kindergartner, maybe. Oh no, that's ridiculous and you know it. Nordic or Viking. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Sold 26. DJ Mix Factory. Now Congrats. this is a woman's ring and it's Marcusite. It's super pretty. I love that one. The one coming up is really pretty. Oh, the elephants. Yeah. Marcusite elephants. So, so pretty. It looks like we're right spot on the size 11 mm -hmm. right here. Really nice, guys. Look at those. Marcusite elephants. It's going. It's going. It says size 11 in it to you. 925. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Just reconfirming what we already tested. Love the elephants. Tons of cute detail on this one. Really nice. I found the ring that matches the necklace and the earrings that I did last week. So, and that'll be coming up soon. Oh my gosh, Marcus Heights, Sterling Silver, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's bit it, bit it, bit it, bit it, bit it. Yvonne's on this one. What's up, Yvonne? Oh, she got it. Yvonne, thanks for being here. This is a Malaysian garnet, and it's 0 0.90. Malaysian garnet. Isn't that gorgeous? It's faceted, 0 0.90. That's pretty. It is so pretty, guys. Pay attention to this one. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah. 0 0.90 carats. Almost a carat. Almost a carat. I got a designer bracelet coming up, too. Super pretty. Run in it? <clears throat> sure. Oh my gosh, guys. Almost a carat of a Malaysian garnet is absolutely stunning. Stunning, stunning, guys. Do not miss this as some real value, guys. Come on, let's go. Real, real value. Let's, let's crack a whack on this. Almost a carat. Beautiful cut. Great depth. All right, Nancy got that. Congrats, Nancy. Congratulations. That was a great deal on that. My Very goodness. Nice. Very nice deal. All right, next piece is gold-plated, and it's a designer bracelet, and it's by Lauren, um, Lauren Lombardi. Lauren Lombardi. It's 14-karat gold-plated um, charm bracelet. It's 7 half inches, and it has a self-closing clasp, 14 karat gold plated brass. Okay, it's made in the USA. This is a designer piece. All right. So it's a handcrafted charm bracelet. All right, chunky circular link, self closing clasp, really beautiful. So gold plated. And I don't think it's 925 though. It says Lauren Lombardi. Not silver though, just a gold plated, whatever the metal is. It's a brass. So brass. it's 14 karat gold plated Lauren Lombardi. That's the important part. I can just guys. tell because the weight seems different. It's beautiful. This is a designer piece, guys. Look it up. Okay, let's go. Lauren Lombardi. That's all right, Mungie. No problem. 14 gold plated, guys. Lauren Lombardi. It's different. Mm -hmm. No, it's beautiful. Super beautiful. This is a very nice designer piece. Made in the USA. Come on now. Let's go. Did you say this is Jade right here? Uh, no, that's the next piece. I have another piece. Okay. Do some reach on the Lauren Lombardi. 
Mama G is throwing it in the chat. We have Disney vintage glass toppers for 15 bucks. Lizzie G, congrats. Oh, that was a good deal. A really good deal. Okay. So this attest is uh, Jadeite Jade right here. And these are the matching earrings. Super pretty. Okay. All right. Congratulations on that beautiful bracelet. This is Jade. I tested in Jadeite Jade. Yes. And those are the earrings. And, the earrings. and that is the necklace. Is it silver? I, it doesn't have, I don't know. It might be, it might not. I didn't look for a mark on that. You can check on the clasp. <clears throat> it's really pretty. It's a very artiste. Hmm. That is different, huh? Yeah, you want to show them the, there we go. I mm -hmm. just didn't know if there was a mark on that. Looks silver, but I cannot tell. Doesn't it? It might be. Yeah. It's a little bit of silver if it is, but I don't see a mark. This is something different, though. Yeah, it's really pretty. It's like a little line, but the, it's very pretty stones. And the way it hangs, if you want to put it on here, Oops. It might be a little easier. Yeah, it's super interesting. It's very pretty the way it hangs. Look at that. That really shows off how pretty it is. And then it has the matching earrings too. All right. <clears throat> We're going to go ahead and run that. I'm going to get a little bigger bag for that one. <clears throat> and again, it comes with the earrings too, guys. We ran at three to four, one to three, which is a little light. So you're going to save on the shipping as well. <laughs> All right, guys. And the earrings come with it right down below. Really pretty. They're like little clusters. I know. They're so cute. So now. All right. The next piece we have going is very cool. It's handcrafted, beautifully made, and it has a maker mark. I believe it's made in Colorado. <laughs> yeah, it's in Denver. All right, amazing works, congrats. It's a sterling nice handmade piece in Colorado, in Denver, and it has a mark on it. Really, really pretty, you can show the mark, and you can weigh it if you want, because it's got a lot of silver. So solid sterling silver, hand engraved, but the maker's mark is on the back. Those are definitely different. Oh, it's handcrafted. They're gorgeous. So you can see the maker mark. Yeah, I don't see a maker mark. It's on the big piece. On the inside. Okay. So they're made in actually Denver. It's only one cuff length though. Yeah. Sterling silver look at that. It's called Gutterman or Gusterman? Gusterman. Sterling silver. Only one cuff link, but we have two tie Tied clips ends, here. Yeah. Did you want to wait? Does it's got a lot of <coughs> Should you four to seven on that? Twenty eight grams, over twenty eight grams of sterling silver on these pieces. Pretty nice. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're gonna run this. Let us say do. Super cool. All right, guys, this is all sterling silver handcrafted from Denver. Super cool. The silver alone is worth quite a bit more than that. Yeah, 27 grams of silver. Scrap on that thing's a dollar a gram or close to it. Mm -hmm. 
All right, 11, 11 bucks. bucks. Wow, 27, around 27 bucks of scrap silver. Yeah. 11 bucks. Okay, you want to do a necklace? Sure, I can do it or you can do it, whatever. <laughs> the heart's up there. Captain Lyle pants is shh. I know, right? <clears throat> All right, here's our little class. This is another 925 silver piece. Mm -hmm. And there's a heart within a heart. Two hearts connected. Oh, what does this say? Super pretty. True friends are forever. Oh, that's pretty. And what else? It's very nice. Huh? The, the something. There's more to it, but. It's a heart and a heart. The heart. So two hearts. Oh, oh no. Two friends are joined at the heart. That's what it says. Oh, that's a nice gift for a friend. Yeah. Super pretty. Mm -hmm. start? Yep. What a great gift for someone. All right. Sterling and silver necklace. The chain's very pretty, too. Very pretty chain. So cute. Heart in the heart is so cute. And Nancy got it for 21 bucks. Congrats, Nancy. Awesome. That's great. 18 inch. It's some sort of glass, I think. It's very, very pretty. <clears throat> Isn't that pretty with the purple? I love it. Yeah. 18 inches, guys. 18 inches on that. Little glass beads here and a glass heart. We got lots of hearts tonight. Yeah, we do, huh? That one's really pretty. There's our clasp. Yeah, very pretty. We're running it, guys. So look at all the purple stones with a really pretty heart. Do you want to? No, I don't want to. It gets washed out, especially with glass. All right. Thank you guys for your bids. Appreciate you all. Very pretty necklace. <clears throat> yeah, it is. It's so beautiful, right? I love it. I love it. All, All right. right, Cindy, congrats. Okay, <clears throat> I can switch with you. Okie dokie. Thank you very much. All right, <clears throat> all right, we have a few more necklaces, rings, and pendants. And let's see, I have a beautiful watch. This one is, um, uh, H O eight six eight one. That's the, that's the number on the back. Help me. Okay, great. Um, really pretty citizens watch. It's WR100. It's like a mother of pearl. Pro master citizen. Pro master citizen. Really good looking watch, guys. I think this one's expensive. Very, very nice. Sure. Okay, we're running. <clears throat> Pro Master Watch. This one's beautiful. Yes, these are very, very nice. All right, Pro Master Watch, guys, come on. Eight bucks sold. Wow. <clears throat> That was a great deal. Congratulations. Congrats. Okay. Uh, let's see here. I have this beautiful sterling silver pendant and it's vintage. It's super pretty. It has a patina on it. I'll measure it for you. It's really, really nice. I can check. Um, let's see from the top to the bottom. It's two and a half inches, two and a half inches. Um, so. No, it's all closed. Sure. 
really, really pretty. I know it does look like a bottle, huh? I know it's so pretty. I love it. Yeah, of course. I love the silver work on it. It's just gorgeous. All right, we're going to go ahead and run it. Oh, wizard, that's so kind. Thank you so much. You're so sweet. Very, very sweet. Oops, and so you can see the, it's 10.8 grams. 10.8 grams, thank you. A beautiful patina, vintage sterling silver, 10.8 grams, two and a half inches, gorgeous. Gorgeous patina, gorgeous style on it, really, really nice. At 13 bucks and we're sold. All right, that's really nice. Enjoy that. All right, guys, I have a few more rings and necklaces, and I have some really cool pendants. Okay, this is kind of different. This is very interesting. <clears throat> a little bit of artwork, Day of the Dog by D. Singh. D. Singh. D. Singh. Day of the Dog. Hmm. Very interesting. Right? So I'm going to put that right there. Day of the Dog. It's a pendant. So we're going to run it. And it has the designer on the back. Do you sing? I'm just writing it right now. Yeah, I need it. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know anything about the artist. Excuse me, it is off the wall. It's very different. All right, Captain Loudpants, congrats. <clears throat> Wizard says, hi guys, you're my favorite. Thank you so much. <clears throat> so sweet. All right, Sterling Silver. Silver earrings right here. These are 925 silver earrings. Let me get the length on them for you. These are little cutie patooties. All right. Length on these is one and a half inches. One and a half inches. All right, they're running. Yeah, it's a play on Day of the Dead, huh? That was that one was. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, guys. 925 silver on these. 925 silver. Just a reminder, everyone, bookmark Mama G show, which is tomorrow, 8 o'clock Eastern, 5 o'clock Pacific. Uh -huh. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for the bids. These are beautiful. Karen, thanks so much. Good night, Karen. Thanks for being here, guys. These are sterling silver, 925 silver. I have some pearl snowman ones that are so cute. They're silver. They're so cute. I'm going to show you guys, guys those ones next. You're going to love them. Camille. Mm -hmm. Did I get it? Sure. Mm -hmm. I told them to clean their bathroom. Hello? We are in an auction. How'd you guess? What? You cut out. Hello? All right. Hello? Has a little maker mark on the back. Put on mute. And they're pearls. <clears throat> With, uh, no, I can't hear you. Snowman. Just come down here and ask. Look at that, guys. Are those not so cute? These are so cute. They're little snowmans with broom. So, so cute. We have a cool little patina on them. They are neat. Neat, 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 neat. Love them. Love them. <clears throat> love, love, love these. These are definitely older and fun. So just a reminder to everyone, next week we will not be doing a Monday show. And we go almost every Monday. So that's not normal for us, but we're going to be enjoying spring break with the girls so we're we're um 
We're instead going live on Friday, 3 p.m. Pacific, and that is going to be part of a raid train competition with some other storage buyers, and uh, that's being organized by the Pirate, so Storage Auction Pirate. <laughs> Thanks, Kathy. Yeah, the t I'm looking forward to the time off. Took a little time off yesterday, relaxed a little bit. All right, congrats. Come in here. Say hello. Hey. Hello. <clears throat> I'm about to go get food. Are you guys good or do you want some? Uh, no, we want some. You have any? Okay, what is this? Is this like something's in here? What are you doing? Look at that. I don't know. Oh, it's a lock? Oh, Tag that's food. so cool. Oh, well, sure. If you want. No. Okay. Well, good. Mom doesn't want tattoo. food. But it doesn't matter. You guys get what you want. It's fine. Why is it blurry? I don't know. Yeah. But it's really pretty. Um, I love this, guys. It's sterling, but it has some painting on it. It's really pretty. Do you want to? Um, I like it. Yeah, it's very old. Sure. Do you want some more? Oh, no, thanks, honey. Can you give me the uh, chicken skewers? The... Okay. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Love you. But you need to. Yeah, she does. She drive. Drive, All yeah. over the place. She just got her license in January, and she drives everywhere. She looks for excuses to drive. <laughs> All right, Camille. Camille's like, do you guys need milk or anything? I'll go to the store for you. Where do you want me to go? She'll go know. over and over. <laughs> I don't know what this is, guys. This is a sterling silver bell, but look at that. Congrats, Yvonne. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. Yes, I know. It's crazy, right? This one's really pretty, guys. Don't miss on this. Don't miss on this. Yeah, isn't that crazy, Kelly? I know, it's so big. I will, yeah, I'll go back and watch some of the older videos, and she's so small. Sad. I know. Yeah. Should we do comic books tonight after this? Because it's so early. We'll see. We have some comic book buyers, maybe. But could also end early. Oh, I know, right, Mom? Yeah. <laughs> She kind of lost her interest in Survivor, and then now... It got weird. Uh, yeah, Survivor got a little weird, too. Huh? But now uh, she wants... We started watching the new season, so we'll see if we can get back into it. Like, we just want to focus on the challenges and the fun. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, well, first-time buyer! Lucky. Congrats. Congrats! Now, now we're watching the Squid Games. This has some sort of mark on it. Uh, the, the Super pretty. reality show version of it. She hasn't seen the the show Squid Games because it's a little adult, but she watched the reality show and that was really good. All right, guys, super cool. This is really neat. Ramel and uh, Sterling. So, yeah, have you heard of that, Mama G? It's on Netflix. And there's the maker mark back there. Oh man, it's so good. The, is this running? Okay, yeah. The uh -huh. show is amazing, but then they made a reality show based on the TV series first. Yeah. Mr. Beast recreated it as a life, real life game, and then uh, they would create a reality show on it, kind of like Survivor. And it's, it is I very this entertaining. Might be, is this like Italy? It's some sort of mark on it. I can't read it. It's really pretty. It's really pretty, guys. This is beautiful. Really pretty. A bar loved Squid Games. I know this is like one of those shows where you start it and you you can't stop it. You just have to watch the whole thing. It's so good. It sucks you in. First episode. Kathy, that was great deal. Kathy, congrats. Um, this one. This one just came out of the locker. It's 925 though, right? It's the overlay. That's a 925 piece. It does not it is not marked unless it's inside the hoop or something. But yeah, in the bail, maybe. I thought maybe it was gold. I brought it to my gold buyer and he said, No, that's silver though. I think it's for me. He confirmed it's, it's a silver piece. Unmarked. That, that came out of the locker. Mm -hmm. <coughs> we had a professional look at it. Yeah. Are you happy she's getting you dinner? Yeah. Are you going to feel up to walking with me tonight? Of course. Awesome. He's been my new walking partner. I'm so happy. Yeah, this one's pretty. Which locker did this come out of, babe? I have no idea. Oh. They all start to blend. It was probably the Kiss locker. Oh, Kiss locker? On the jewelry boxes. Okay, Kiss locker. It was a recent locker for sure. The one he bought, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'd say Kiss blurred. is the only one that had silver in it lately. That was a good locker. That was a great locker. It's really pretty, though. 
That's a really pretty design on it. 11 bucks. Good Lizzie, job. congrats. Okay. All right, I have this black onyx ring. Black onyx ring. Super pretty. <clears throat> I love the pattern on it. It is a <clears throat> seven and three fourths. That's the giveaway. Seven and three fourths. Really nice. Vintage black onyx ring. <clears throat> We're running it. Seven and three fourths. I saw my friend Manuel today. And I hadn't seen him in a long time. We love Manuel. Year or two. And uh, he has a very successful YouTube and Facebook. Does videos in Spanish and has a huge following. Um, he does a great job. And he's probably retiring from the video world. What? You should listen to that. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Well, he's he took like a two year hiatus, came back, and then he's like, "Yeah, I'm probably gonna stop." He says he just loves going through locker so much, but the videoing really slows you down and kind of changes it a little bit. And I'm like, "Yeah." In two five. Someday maybe I'll retire the video portion and just be 100 percent locker digger. Size seven. This match the. I always love congrats on that last one. Size seven, guys. We were not going anywhere. <clears throat> this one's beautiful. Size seven. We had the matching necklace. We're not going anywhere. So beautiful ring. This one's very nice. That's a cool one. It is a cool one. We sold the necklace and the earrings last oh, week. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, dang it. This is so beautiful. It's old. Thanks, Keith. Keith, I think got the last one, yeah. Oh, maybe. I yeah. Think. Keith, did you get the other matching pieces last week? I know you bought two pieces that matched, if I remember correctly. Size 5 CZ ring, lots of silver, super cool. Wait a minute. What is going on here? There's <laughs> another ring inside of it. This is hilarious. When does that ever happen? Oh, my gosh. That is so mm -hmm. funny. Another ring was inside of it. It's a size 8. Look at this. It was stuck inside. That's funny. That is so funny, you guys. You gave birth. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. He bought the earrings and bracelet before. I thought so. Okay. Nice. Size 8 CZ ring. This one's beautiful. Size 8 again. It gave birth to another ring. We'll do that one next. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, leave them together. <laughs> Maybe they'll pop a few more out before next week's <laughs> CZ size 8. Beautiful ring. This one's really nice. That's hecka funny. You got to get your hand in there or something because it's blowing out. Now we're, eight. Now we're all about silver, guys. Now we're all about the Brooklyn Nine Nine watching that. Oh my gosh. It's so I just don't funny. want it to end. It's so funny. This is very good. Good TV. Andy Sandberg is so hilarious. Okay, guys, I have some really nice killer chains. I'll do one or two. And if they go well, I'll keep going. I have this wee baby ring. This one's That's blurry. <clears throat> Looks not too bad. Couldn't Sorry. Let me see if I have. Can you? Just don't put on the black. Just put it in your hand. It's, it looks so much better. Yeah, see how it sharpens up? It gets, it gets so, Nancy. Nancy, congrats. All right, let's see what the wee baby ring is. It's a four and three fourths. That's me. Everyone's like, what? Your hand is that small? It is. This is a four and three fourths. And this is actually a really beautiful ring. That's pretty, guys. Four and three fourths. So pretty. <laughs> so little. Yeah, I got little fingers for how tall I am. It's really pretty, though. This one's old. It's vintage. It's got a neat pattern all the way around it. Really solid. So pretty. <clears throat> I have some more smaller rings. If you guys want them in the thing, I'll pull them out. I'll pull them out for y'all because y'all want them. All right, Nancy, congrats. Nancy, congrats. All right, this one's gorgeous. I just love it. <clears throat> Let's get the length on it. So, so pretty. Mm -hmm. If you guys want comic books after the jewelry, let us know. <clears throat> I could do a little. I'm up for it. 
<clears throat> believe it or not. All right. It's uh, 19 inches. Look at that. That is really nice. Look at the clasp on it. Again, a lot of these are Italy. Really, really good looking. I'm going to run it. 19 inches. Beautiful cut on that. So pretty. So, so pretty. <clears throat> I have some even heavier silver chains if you guys want them. Um, that are a little thicker and pretty expensive. But I'll do them if you want them. Oh my goodness. I gotta be able to do this faster. Okay, look at that. It's so pretty, right? You see that? I love the pattern. Mary, congrats. Congrats, Mary. That was really nice. Okay, this one is way more silver. And look at that. You guys, these are some really nice high-end necklaces. Look at this. This is gorgeous. I love the cut. Does anyone know what that's called? This one's Italy. Made in Italy. This is an Italian one. Gorgeous cut, okay? <laughs> Not me, I know, right? Okay, I'm going to give you the length on it. This is made in Italian, and it has that, like, Look to it where it looks like diamonds almost. <clears throat> Super shiny. 20. Oh my gosh, guys. 28 inches. 28 inches of absolute beauty. I just want you to see that. Look at that. 28 inches. So beautiful. Made in Italy. Great, great cut on that. Oh, this is like. Do you think maybe we moved this light funny or something? I don't know. It's just... It's like... So when it's on the black, it gets blown out, so... I know, it's just hard because that's what makes it look so way pretty. Just don't put it on the black. It's way better. I know, but everything looks so pretty on that. Yeah. This is gorgeous. Made in Italy, guys. Hold Made in bit. Italy. Yeah, no. Zoom you hold up. Made in Italy. It's a beautiful one. I have one or two heavier ones. <clears throat> All right. And we are sold. Congrats. Yeah, let's congrats. <clears throat> All right. This That's one's my neat. money one of the day. Okay. This one, I believe, is Italy, too. This one has got a ton of silver. Classic. As you can tell, my, my favorite patterns. This one's heavier. And let me get the link. And I'll get you the weight. <coughs> uh, let's see. The. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is like 28 plus, 28 plus inches on that. Look at that. That's a nice one. Oh, yeah. Made in Italy. Super nice. Right? Let's get a weight. It's about 23 grams. We're going to run it. I'm ready. All right, my friends. And you think you'll have a video out tomorrow, right, honey? Tomorrow morning. It's already done. Wow. That's I started fun. watching it. Brandon did a great job once again. He's doing our editing. He's, he's just a great editor. Made in Italy, guys. This is made in Italy, so don't mess on this. I mean, I'm there going through the locker and filming it, but then when I watch it, he makes it so fun to watch. It's good. Over again. Made in Italy, guys. This is heavy duty, big money, lots and lots. He just texted you. That's so funny. Isn't that funny? So. Yeah. All right, guys, made in Italy. Don't let it go like this. Come on, guys. This is cheaps for this one. And we are sold.
Alice, congrats again. All right. This one's a beauty. It's got that beautiful cut to it again. I love this one. Sherry, do I miss your old <laughs> intro? <laughs> yeah. I do too sometimes, but the, the the way YouTube works, they just want faster, quicker. People tune off too quick. People's attention spans are getting shorter and shorter. TikTok ruins it for everyone. I think they have short attention spans. 20 inch, guys. This is that beautiful 20 inch made in Italy sparkler. 20 inch. Let's go. 20 inches. 20 inches. Look at that. So pretty. It's awesome. 20 inches, beautiful. I love this chain, guys. I really do. So pretty. Wow, what a deal. What a deal. What a deal. Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Bid, bid, bid. Someone's getting a great, great deal. All right. I can see if you want me to pull out some more rings. Let me know. I have a couple more, I think. Sold. All right. Real quick, we're going to enter into win a beanie while I pull out the next thing. So let's enter in. Beanie win a giveaway. Beanie. <clears throat> beanie giveaway alert. Here we go. Beanie All right. Giveaway. $25 value. If you guys want a beanie and don't want a chance, the chance, <clears throat> you can always go in the buy it now and get it. And uh, 25 bucks plus shipping. Beautiful 18 inch sterling silver chain with this key and purple stone pendant. 18 inch right here. Look at that cute little key and stone. That's so pretty. Look at that. So pretty. Look at that. 18 inch Oops. silver chain. Is it running? Yeah. Oh, good. You're fine. That's awesome, Kathy. Beautiful necklace. Mary, congrats. That was a great one. <clears throat> All right. Congrats. Here's a very long chain. Okay. Let me get a measurement on it. <clears throat> this one is 28 inches of silver, 28 inches, and it's a sparkler. It is a sparkler. We're running it. It's dollar starts for all our silver guys. 28 inches on this. Look at that. <clears throat> so <pretty laughs> Kathy, that's funny. My mom's having the locker note sticker on her car for a long time. Know, it's, it's so the cute. old logo, too. And it doesn't even fade. It's like totally weathers the Yeah, I know. It's so funny. She's your mom. She should. No, but I'm seeing the sticker like it's so durable. 22 sold. That was a great deal on that one. Congrats. All right, this one's super pretty. I love the little pendant to it. 18 inch necklace. Look at that little marcasite. Little stone. Oh my gosh, I love it. Stro do we have any Pandora charm bracelets? No. We do find them from time to time. And when we do find them, we put them in the auction, but not right now. I love this charm. It is sterling silver. Look how pretty that is. Little marcasite. I love this one. So pretty, right? So, so pretty. We are sold. Delightfully raw. What's up? Thank you so much. All right, I have two more, two more necklaces. Oh, we're getting down to it, aren't we? We got some other stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. Got some other stuff to go back to after jewelry, if you guys want. A little bit more, well, a little you more Disney stuff. There for me, honey. All right, eighteen inch with this cute little <clears throat> stone, little peridot, and purple amethyst, cute sterling silver chain. Sweet honey bee, hello, hello. 
Also, if you guys want comics, let us know because we can always <coughs> do some random pull comics. We have boxes of comics. So now, okay, Beth B S C says yes, please Disney. We have a little bit of Disney stuff left, including like the Mickey ears. They didn't go that high earlier. And the games. We didn't have enough people. Oh yeah, we have some sealed games from the locker. Those are totally nice. Six bucks. Oh my gosh. Six bucks. Ooh, another. <coughs> A little below scrap, probably, on that. Good pickup. This one is gorgeous. Sterling silver. Look at this necklace. This is a nice chain, guys. A very nice chain. Okay. Beautiful. I'm just going to look and see if there's any more five size five rings. Like you asked. This is sterling silver. This is a gorgeous. It looks like, like that snake chain. Sterling Silver and CZ Pendant, guys. Oh, yeah, you can enter the gift today, too. That's oh, right. That's Thanks, right. And, and we haven't mentioned it in the last few minutes, so everyone make sure that you're following Mama G. She's doing her second auction tomorrow, tomorrow and that's at 8 p.m. Pacific. Oh, I'm sorry, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific tomorrow, so Tuesday. And uh, you can click on her in the chat right there and follow her. And also, if you bookmark her show, you get a reminder on that. That one sold for 19 to Mary. Congrats, Mary. Wow, Mary. Congrats. That's a good deal. On that. That's really pretty. Mm -hmm. All right. I have, I have a couple smaller rings <clears throat> if you want me to do them. But I have one more nice chain left. You guys got to buy it, though. You got to pay for this one. This one's really pretty. I think they pay for everything. I'm using the money. Like, oh, well, Mary is Christmas shopping for her daughter. That's great. <laughs> wow, that's impressive. And S. Vazbev, 24 inches, just won the beanie cap. Congrats to you. Awesome. I have some, yeah, smaller ones. 24 inches on this. This is a beauty. Another Italian necklace. 24 inches of silver. My last beautiful one. Like this, guys. It's my last one. So I don't get very many of these Italian ones. And I'll put some rings on here and you guys can pick. I can just do a few. I think these ones are smaller. So. This looks like a DNA strand. So pretty. This one's gorgeous. Ooh. The DNA matrix or whatever you call it. Congrats, mm -hmm. Barb. <clears throat> All right. Congrats. I have some smaller ones here. See these? This one's super sweet. That, that's different. Oh, yeah. A lot of silver in that one. This one, super cute. Is that what it says, Israel? Let me have Jack read that. Look on the inside and see if it says Israel. I'll let him look in the loop. I have this one. Let me. Super pretty. has some sort of maker mark in it too. This one's really nice. It says Zuman, Z U M A N, Zuman 925. This one's gorgeous. Israel. It does say Israel, but it says Zuman. Nice eye, maker? Mama G. Good grief. Yeah. My gosh. It does say Israel. She's wearing her glasses or not. <clears throat> you go, girl. All right. I have some really pretty ones. So let me see here. And then I also have this really pretty silver band. Okay. I'll do the zoom in one. This one's nice. This one I can tell. I was like, oh, you that's nice. That yeah. It's not. It's just CZs. Uh, it's just a seven. A seven on that one. Isn't that pretty? Glasses and a very large monitor. Oh, yeah. That helps, right? Oh my gosh, pro, this one's so tip. pretty, you guys. Pro tip, I love it. Pro tip. Oh my gosh, guys. Israel, this is a higher quality ring, I'll just say. For sure. Look at me. I'm just bringing it out. Oh, I did the size. I can do it again. It is a six and three fourths. See ya, Barb. Thank you so much. Wrist is throbbing. Oh no, that's no fun. Yeah. That's Israel. Look here. at all the silver on that. This is a very high-end ring. Oh, it's the designer, Nola Zuman. So this is a designer ring, guys. Don't miss it. 
Design a ring right here. Ding, ding, ding. Sold. Design a ring for 25 bucks. Yvonne, good pickup. That was a good deal. This one's really pretty. Oh, no. She broke her wrist. Oh, my oh, gosh. No. I, do, I fractured my wrist. It is not fun. Mm, sorry, Barb. Size 10. Look at that beauty. Size 10. Does that look okay on this? Like this? Not even my hand there? Is that yeah. clear? Size 10. This one's gorgeous. I love the work on here. Oh, I'm so sorry. That is no fun. Yeah, size 10. I know it's so pretty, right? <laughs> I have some really pretty little ones. Read what this one says inside just for fun. Good night. Feel better. 21 sold. Cat Jor, congrats. All right. This one's super pretty. It is a size five and three fourths. Five and three fourths. I really, it's like one of those spinners. Five and three fourths. But this one's really pretty. Five and three fourths. Gorgeous little ring. The same ring? It says Zinzi. Z I N Z I. Huh. Zinzi. Oh my gosh, Kathy. Ugh. Good all grief. Right. This is true. This is all 925, guys. 925. All right. Thanks, Darlene. Who got the hat? I didn't see. I read it at the time. Oh, okay. Sorry. Darlene, congrats. 19 congrats. bucks sold. Again, this one's kind of bestowed my heart, guys. This is a six. This one's good looking. And what was the name inside again? Zin Z Z I N Z I. Okay, guys. So this has a Zin Z is the maker on this size five. This is a nice, you could just tell this is a quality made ring. Zin Z. Look it up. Size five. Okay. We're going. Beautiful ring. The silver on this is gorgeous. Guys, don't let it go. Come on, this is a really nice ring. I picked this one because it seemed the highest uh, quality, really. The silver and the design on it was just stunning. Yeah, the braid on it's so pretty. Thank you so much. We're sold. Beth Bia, congrats. Okay, this little pretty one is super cute. It is a six and three fourths. Six and three fourths. Look at that. Six and three fourths. That is vintage. It's so cool. Six and three fourths. Oh. I love this one. Very pretty. Get tired. Are you? Long day. Yeah, I, I left know. early. You did. 9.30 auction, an hour and 15 minutes away. I didn't sleep all. I'm running on four hours. All right, what Disney items do you guys want? Do you want the sealed games too? I'm going to run a couple more rings. Thank you guys so much for your bids. This is a beautiful little vintage ring. Sterling silver, very pretty. I love all the little detail on it. It's so lovely. All right, Mary, congrats. Mary, congrats. Um, I'm going to test the stone on this one really quick. I don't remember. I thought it was just like a little CZ or... Yeah, it's not testing as anything precious. I just want to make sure. So. That is so pretty though. Right? Just seven and three fourths. So pretty, right? <gasps> I love this one. Not precious stone, though. 
So, so pretty, CZ. Oh my gosh. I just love this ring, the blue. Look how pretty it looks on the hand. Oh. So, so pretty. I know, right? Oh, man. I'm starting to yawn. It's okay. Go get a snack, babe. No, I don't know. There's muffins in there. The rice man. Okay. All right, I got a really pretty silver band. Size 8. It's really nice. This is a really, really pretty size 8 silver vintage band. Real classic. Very, very classic. I love it. I love, love, love it. Oh, this stuff too, huh? I don't know. This is a stone, and it, I'm going to show it to them so they can decide. And this one I'm going to do it next. Any size 12 or 12 and a half. Oh, look. We had some earlier. All right. Silver man, guys. Silver man. This one's a very nice vintage silver band. Nice millimeter on that. Really pretty. Yeah. It's a real pretty one. It's just nothing better than a classic vintage silver band. It's just good looking. Just good looking. Sold. They don't just... Okay, guys. You, this is really pretty, okay? I'm a little leery to do it. But let me just test this stuff. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, I'm going to show you in here. Yeah, I'm going to test it. You guys tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. How do you look to? Okay. It's a green stone. It's really, really pretty. Okay, look. What is it? Mm -hmm. Tourmaline garnet, a green garnet. Hey, Jack 520. <clears throat> I know. It's. I don't think it is. Oh, okay, no problem. <laughs> Thanks so much. It's past the red, but I don't know. I just love this. Sorry for breaking you guys. Okay, <laughs> we got some good stuff. This is so in, beautiful. Okay, and it's old. <coughs> it's size eight. So pretty. Do you guys like that? Should I do it? It's silver, gold covered, gold coated silver, and it's so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. We're just gonna run it. Oh, because I love it. <laughs> that green is so pretty. And look how big it is. Do you see the depth of the stone on the side? Gorgeous, gorgeous ring. Super pretty, and it is vintage. And it's a big, big stone. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Look at it, guys. Look at that color. So, Mazi, congrats. Can do some uh, gemstones or meteorites. Sure. Like and this one. I'm gonna get your size on that. Uh, Yahoo Yellow. What's up? Um, we did most of the Disney items. Eight and a half. We had uh, like the Mickey ear hats and. Eight and a half guys. Eight and a half. On know, this. Maybe some baseball hats, but we also yeah. Eight and a half on that. I think that's about it for the Disney. We'll have. More Disney coming up. I find more Disney stuff in that locker, but I've got a couple other lockers that I jump over to, and those ones have some great this one's finds. Pretty. Yeah, I'm unsure of the stone on this one, but it's very pretty. It's like a green with black. We can do some of that. Uh, <coughs> get back to some Disney stuff here in a little bit, though. We're almost sure. out of jewelry. Maybe we'll do some gemstones. Oh my gosh, this one's so cool, guys. This is old. This one's so cool. Is that like someone's initials or? It's like CTR. 
Um, this next locker, you know, I actually forget exactly what we find in it, but it was a guy, he kept his stuff for his, like, whole Size life. Eight guys. I think it's in his 60s, and, um, I find some pocket knives, we find some coins, we find some baseball cards, right? We found a lot of baseball cards. Sterling silver, guys, sterling silver on this. And, uh, some concert tickets, like vintage concert tickets. I'm trying to think. It was some cool stuff, mostly small stuff, too. Records? Yeah, I don't know if we'll do the records. <clears throat> we the beer stuff, the pens, oh, the yeah, baseball the beer, pens, beer, like, uh, beer, the yep. you know, for the draft or whatever. The I forget what you call it, the handles, you know. We do have coins. We have rock in records. one of the other lockers. We got. Yeah, we got coins coming up in a couple weeks. We got coins, and we got killer records. Actually, we have two. We have some really, really good records. So yeah, like we need to go through them because they're that good. Oh, uh, yes, yeah, so that's what my own. Um, next week, we will not be going on Monday. We're going to go on Friday. We're going to be, well, we'll be on vacation for the Monday show, but the Friday, we're doing a raid train. So it's going to be a, a um, competition with some other storage buyers. It'll be fun. Six and a half. It says Dream Believe 925 right here. So you guys, RJ. make sure you bookmark next week's show. I've got the placeholder up 3 p.m. Pacific next week on Friday the 5th. Yeah. It's a seven and a half. It says an eight on here, but it's not. RJ. Dream Belief, Sterling and Silver. Yeah, we'll do some of that. The next video comes out tomorrow morning, and that's part one of two of this locker, and it's it's, it's some really interesting stuff. I like I like that locker. And then the one after that, we'll find like a lot of handbags. Mm -hmm. The records are pretty cool, though. Yeah, I found a crate of records, and it's mostly rock. And then that other locker you found, the other records, we just haven't gone through them yet. We're not sure. Are you going to auction some of those? We'll see. We'll see. All right, guys, Sterling Silver here. What Do you want to line up what other Disney stuff? We could do those Mickey Mouse ears all in one lot, if you want to do that, if they want them. Uh, thanks, Tanya. Tanya says, looking forward to the next video. Thank you. This one's really cute. 13 is old. August, congrats. All right, we're going to do one more ring, then we're going to move on. Okay? I have a couple little ones. Let me see what I have here. This Good night, Mary. Here. Thank you for being here. Oh, here's another dream one. This is cute. Size a seven and a half dream silver ring. Super cute. Good night, Nancy. Dream. Good night, Kathy. Or they're saying good night to Mary, maybe. Yeah. yeah All right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have sterling silver earrings. I forgot about this. Dreams. This one's super cute. Sterling silver. <clears throat> and I have some small <clears throat> sterling silver. Yeah, I can do those. Earrings. I have some silver earrings that are sterling silver, brand new. Brand new, brand new. I'm going to do them all together. Let's just be fun, huh? Thank you, Debbie. That's so kind. Thank you. Every week we try to have a little different stuff. Yeah. Next week will be, next week will be some nice variety. Yeah. For like a single guy in the 60s, and some of the stuff I think he had his whole life. All right, guys, cool we're going to do a power lot here. This is Delightfully Raw, congrats. Sterling Silver, Little Stars. Ster these are all new. Sterling silver stars. These are all sterling. These are all so cute. 14 karat gold filled. So cute, right? So some good value here. You're getting three sets of brand new sterling earrings. Make a great gift. Okay, I'm going to run them. So bid accordingly, guys, because I put three in here. Okay, so you're getting a lot here. You're getting a lot, so don't mess around. Three brand new pair of sterling silver earrings, guys. Three. I'm hoping to get at least 30 bucks for these. Want to try another one of these? Sure, that's fine. All right. Do the games too, yeah? Yeah, the games are so cool. $31 sold. Congrats. Congrats. 
Congrats, August. All right, this is super cool. It's vintage, it's old, it's some sort of stone. Actually, can you give me the black light? I wonder what, if it'll make any like noise in the black light. I don't know if it would, but it's a wrap bracelet and it's old. It's extremely cold, so it's some sort of stone. So three in the middle for us, but the other ones don't. But it's just super cool. It's a vintage piece and I love it. And it can fit anyone because it wraps. It's really cool. Stone bracelet. Really, really neat. It wraps and it's very pretty. It's a vintage piece and I like it. I like old things that are really cool. I don't know what kind of stone it is, but it's very cool. Someone's going to enjoy it. I hope they do. Sold 11 bucks. Okay, this one's really cool. I don't know what this is. I don't know what it's made out of. It's old it's Japanese. It looks like it might have been on like a pen or something. But I just thought it was so cool. I don't know what this is made out of. It's like a pale pink. Okay, really neat. And it's Japanese and it's cool. <clears throat> We're running it. I like cool old things and this is cool and old. I love her expression on her face. It's so cool. It's very beautiful. We got those games coming up. If you want those next, I have meteorites. If you want meteorites, you want me to do those next time? Gemstones. I can. I can do whatever you want me to do. I am at your disposal. I love her expression. Oh, you want the clue game? Okay. Okay. Seven bucks sold. All right. I'm going to do one raw opal. Because I have that here. This one's a beauty. It's big. It's beautiful. It's got blues and greens. These are got some nice value to them. We're going to do the games up next, and then we can come back to gemstones. It's a raw opal, and it's going. Hey, Paula. Hey, Paula. How's it going, my friend? All right, guys. These are pretty valuable, so you're getting a really good deal right now. Good griefies. Four bucks. Holy moly. That was a steal. Whoa. That was a new record low. Madeira, that was a great deal on that. Yeah. Okay. So let's move on to the clue game. Let me clean up my clear mess the, here. Clear the stage. Clear the stage. Let me clear the stage. We'll come back to some gemstones if you guys want garnets and emeralds, but we're going to do these games we have. Because Jack can't wait to ship them out. I'm joking, honey. It is a joke. We can just do the games they request too. We have a Monopoly um, and Clue. So. Okay, all these games are sealed. Uh, shrink wrap is still brand new. Came out of the recent locker. And first up is Clue. <coughs> all right. Parker Brothers, classic detective game, ages eight and up. Shrink wrap, brand new, boxes in perfect condition. And, uh, I don't know, 2005. All right. I think everyone knows what Clue is. Get a Clue and buy Clue. It's a great game, actually. It's one of our kids' favorites. Okay. They, little, they loved it. All right, nice. Oh, thank you so much, Cindy. All right, guys, brand new sealed clue. Brand new sealed, guys. <clears throat> Let's go. We can just take me to. That's fine. Whatever. <clears throat> All right. Eight dollars sold. Congratulations. That's great. Congrats. Enjoy. 
enjoy. All right, do you guys want the Disney um, ears? Uh, I still have those. We can do them as a lot. And then Jack has the hat. Oh, you have the troll. Okay. This vintage troll right here. This is four to seven. Wait. And this is a 1985. Copyright. Damn. D A M. Uh oh, Jenna. Is this two to three pounds, She's honey? Chew me out for cussing. Yeah, it was two to three pounds. Two to three. I don't remember so that. there's a little trolley came out of the locker as well. <laughs> so you guys want that? Starts at a book. Starts at a book. Can't miss that. But you know, a vintage troll man. These things, people collect these. It's crazy. Crazy, crazy. Oh yeah. I love these. Yeah, see if they want. You guys want the pins on these pins <coughs> racing hats? This one appears to be signed by Daryl Waltrip. Whoops. It's got a signature, and then I got a second one that's not signed. Pins oil racing hats. Hey babe, where's the tag on this one? We sold this one. I don't see a tag. The one we sold is right there. Oh, okay. No. All right. Okay. We can sell another one though if you want. Uh, no more. <laughs> I don't. We don't have any more opals here. But even if we did, I don't, we can't sell them for four bucks. Kathy got that one for thirteen. Congrats. Oh, awesome. No electronics tonight. Um, no electronics. Do you guys want this? Two hats. Pennzoil racing. Sign. They have some value, guys. All right, four to seven or eight to 11. <clears throat> okay, so there's two. This one right here appears to be signed by Daryl Waltrip. In, uh, I found another one that was signed when I researched it, and I think it's from the 90s. I forget. Okay, cool. You see that? You see it? Okay, guys, we're going to start those two hats for a book. Just a book. Just a book. You get two. Two guys signed racing hat right here. Look it up if you need to. Two of them. <clears throat> right out of the lockers. All right, Southeast Oklahoma, congrats. Nice pick up on that right there. Cool, cool. All right. Um, oh, someone wasn't paying attention. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. They missed it. What did they miss? That. Oh. I guess. I thought they were talking about the clue game. Right okay. Um, oh, the opals. Oh, dang it. Yeah, that one, for, like Jana said, that was probably... The lowest we've ever sold an open. We usually sell for like $30, $40, <laughs> $50, even more. All right. So, no problem. No problem. So, these Disney hats, nobody wants these. So no, nobody wants these. Oh, thank you, Paula. Yeah, that's a, we've gotten some interesting lockers lately. Having some fun. Yeah. And it's kept me busy. I say that I say I've been working like a hundred percent as hard as before the heart attack and the surgery and everything. Like I'm, I'm back to working a hundred percent, even though I'm not in like a hundred percent health, I'm working a hundred percent as hard and I love it. I really do. Um, I was trying to get that center there, but that's a little, uh, meteorite there. Space rock found in Northwest Africa. Watching that. Just let me get the weight changed. A little chunk of, a media right there. Yeah, I've been buying these big lockers and putting in long days to clean them out. It feels fantastic. I love it. And he's walking. Yeah, with thank you, night. Lizzie. Walking at night. I wasn't even walking before. So I'm actually doing a little bit more than I did before. Idle hands. That's right, we're seeing. I mean, I feel like I've been pushing myself too. And I think the pushing yourself. That's how you get back, you know, get more energy. It's like, just like working out, you have to wait, you know, 
Four bucks. Lift. Um, oh, okay. I'm not going to do any more of those either. <laughs> All right, I'm going to do one gym. Let's so. give Let's something see. away. We're basically giving stuff away anyways. Let's give something away. Oh, my gosh. Honey. All right. You give something away. I'm going to do an amethyst. Give a good Oh, Lizzie back. says, I'm two years post-op quadruple bypass. Oh, nice. my. Praise God. Yes. I want to take that out. I didn't list those. Oh. I just you put those in there it. a minute ago. Well, you... Dark Vader, though. The Dark Vader patch. Whatever. Did you list this? Uh-huh. You did? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I just put the ring in there one minute ago to clean it. All right, let's go ahead and give this Dark Vader Darth patch. Vader patch. May the Another Force be with you. Just some fun. May the Force silliness. be with you. All right, you guys, make sure it's up here. It's over here somewhere. The giveaway button. I'm going to do a natural amethyst. Why not? Let's just see what happens. We may technically really just be giving it away. All right, I'm going to try to use this back because it's really washed out. Okay, perp. This is a faceted AAA amethyst. Let's give it all away. Yeah, all of these. All right, this is a beautiful amethyst, guys. Look how big that is. Super nice. I'm just tell me up a box, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so funny. Oh, you've been wanting a met. That's awesome. I'm so glad you got the meteor. Oh, great. That makes great, me great, happy. Great. That makes me happy. All right, guys. Authentic right here. This is a, yeah, that's right. This is an amethyst. We're running it. They're running an amethyst. Oh, uh, yeah. It's May the 4th one. be with you, show. That's when we started whatnot. It was two years ago on May 4th. Can you believe that? Two years ago. Yeah. It was a comic book show. Paula got it for eight bucks. Eight bucks. I don't think we're going to do comic books tonight. No, I think we're going to call it pretty early tonight. Okay, that's fine. Um, which is fine because it's like tomorrow I got to pack all this stuff up and go get my trailer and get ready for the flea market on Wednesday. And they're starting some work tomorrow at the house. Mm. All right. Garnet, fasted garnet, triple A. Mm. You don't have to babysit them. It's fine. <laughs> Be here. There you go. <clears throat> sure. You with it? Oh, thanks. Very much. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, this is a garnet. Oh, well, that's a help. Look at that. Yep. He's a magic man. I'm a professional. He's a professional. This one's beautiful, guys. This is a nice faceted garnet. You guys are getting deals. Come on. Six bucks. Pocket scout for six bucks. All right, let's give something else away. What should we do? Uh, let's draw the Darth Vader. <coughs> Sure. Patch. Good luck, everybody. And then we've got a little video game to give away. Clemdira. No, I was going to do another stem. Okay. Well, we can stop. That's fine. Uh, <laughs> giveaway. Join in the giveaway. And this is a, okay. It just says giveaway game. I didn't know the name. It's very vague. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't know what this is, I'm actually. Like... Maybe some rare game that's worth money. We didn't look it up. Okay. Well, what then is it, like a game the or something? Can you turn it over and see if it says what it is? We didn't have any raids today. DS, maybe it is like a DS game, huh? Yeah, it could be. Eight, Something eight, good. eight, 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 and one. Huh. Eights and one. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to do... I'm going to do an opal. Yes, for opals, I'm going to give you another chance to actually bid on an opal. Opal alert. Let's go. Come on, guys. Let's bid. Let's bid. It's an actual opal. It's Cabochon Natural Ethiopian Opal. Worth some good money. But I'm going to see if we can get this bid up. I guess not. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's so funny, guys. All right, let's go, let's go, let's bid, bid, bid. It's an actual real opal. It's a real one. Ten bucks. Opal. Lizzie got it. Congrats. All right. The okay, next giveaway, we got another one last giveaway, right? That's our last one. Yeah, it is. Get that in there. Oh, uh, well, wait. First, we got to give away the, the You're game. This guy. Okay. Good luck, everyone. Who's winning? Southeast Oklahoma, you got a free game. Nice. Awesome. Congrats. Hopefully that's something valuable, huh? That'd be kind of fun. Let us is. know. Came out of a locker. That's all I know. 
All right, next up, we're going to do this beanie giveaway. So, um, good luck, everybody. It's over here. Giveaway button. First giveaway win. Yeah, oh, that's that, exciting. That I love that. Yeah. That's good. Good for you. Make sure you bookmark our next show next Friday, April 5th. You do not want to miss it. Everyone have an amazing Easter who celebrates Easter. And we'll see you again next Friday, not Monday, but Friday. And again, right. don't Easter's forget. This weekend, huh? Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. And I have to plan the whole Come thing on top of everything else. <laughs> what? You have plenty of time. Yeah. You're not busy. No, no not at all. <laughs> you too, Kathy. Thanks, Kathy. Have a blessed Easter. Um, and tomorrow night, don't forget, tomorrow night's Mama G's auction. Three o'clock. Oh, yeah. Our auction next Friday is at three o'clock. A different time because we're doing a raid train and competition. But so it'll be slots. But yeah, bookmark it and we'll get a thumbnail put together <coughs> at some point to list all the people that are involved. And I think they're going to start at like 11 o'clock. And I think Pirates... Pirates organizing it, so Pirates kicking 11. it off. Are we last then? Pirate is uh, kicking it off at 11 a.m. So, uh, yeah, thank you, Lizzie. So, um, but we'll list all that, and there'll be more. Pirate will be talking about it a lot, too, I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. He's putting it together, so. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for being here. We appreciate you. Thanks, Mama G. Thank you, Cash Money. Yeah, thanks, Mama G, for modding. And again, tomorrow night's our show. Don't forget to check it out. Yeah, tomorrow night. Her show's on at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 Eastern. 8 o'clock Eastern. Oh, J Jenna says, I just bought my first locker after watching your videos. Thank you for the inspiration. Just starting off, but excited to see where it goes. That's so exciting. So exciting. That is exciting. Thanks, Alice. You have a happy Easter, too. Thanks, Darlene. Thanks. Yeah, the, we're going to um, try to do something a little bit, something with the girls, you know. Just a couple days. We're going down to. We only got a couple more we're years going with to, them. <clears throat> we're going to go see a college for Camille, and then yeah. we're going to go see Jack's dad. Yeah. So <clears throat> it'll be fun. Yep. Yep. All right. Well, let's pick a winner. Okay, 37 entries for the beanie cap. Good luck, everyone. 38 now. This lens is driving me crazy with the fog air. Probably needs to be wiped down. Probably got handled. Oh. KFRC won it. KFRC. <laughs> KFRC. That was a radio Ooh. station around here. KFRC, 99. Great, what was it? Great station. Um, I don't remember, but congrats to you for the getting the beanie cap. And I think we're done for the night, guys. We sold 155 lots tonight that's going to mean a lot of packing tomorrow so how many 155 mm -hmm. right there? that's the order so yeah huh yeah i'm hungry okay so it's 155 right on so that's a pretty good night and uh all right get some good nights oh oh you remember that station too huh yeah right on thank you let's see that's right let's see if we can find one of our friends if anybody's on live we could rate them right now yeah let's see no one rated us tonight. Okay. You kind of make me sad. I don't think so. No I don't one. see anyone I know. None of our close friends are on. No one we really know. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. We tried. All right. All right, you Didn't guys. That, have right? a good night. <laughs> Again, don't forget to check out Mama G tomorrow night. And we'll be back next Friday. Yeah. Mama G tomorrow night. Scalabanko is also starting tomorrow night. Mm -hmm. um, Bookmark, bookmark our next show. Is he still on? Storage. I'm trying to remember the name. His name because he changed the name. Storage Expeditions, I think. So, mm -hmm. no, you don't remember. Don't remember it. So, he's on at 4. Mama G is on at 5 tomorrow night. So, we'll hopefully, so hope to see you guys there. All right? We'll hope be to there. See you there. We'll be there. I'll be popping in. Well, Jan will probably be bidding on some stuff, too. She always has great stuff. She does. Yeah. All right, you guys. She'll be there. <laughs> That's funny. I love it. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much for being here tonight. We appreciate it. And thank you, Mama G, for being our moderator once again, as always. Yep. We appreciate you too. And uh, hope everyone has a good night. Tomorrow morning, another YouTube video is out. Check it out. All right. Check it out. Good night. God bless. See you next time. Oh, my goodness. Good night.